in the beginning. <laughs> yeah, I started liking Naruto once he got with Jiraiya, basically. <laughs> Damn. Damn. So, you know, I'll, I'll say I started liking him at the forest. Yeah. But in the beginning, beginning, he was annoying. Him and that Believe It was a little annoying. Oh, yes. Uh, to hear he, repeatedly. The main guy has his own catchphrase, too. Like, hey, that's the, that's the worst catchphrase from the main person I've ever heard. Uh, all right, we're live. Alex, what's up? Yo! Let, Double low in the building, baby. Let me know, you guys, if... If it's too loud, uh, if, if not he's too loud, but the the, the sound for uh, for Devin is too loud, let me know, uh, so I can put it down. But yeah, Megalodon Rex, what's up? Zai, what's up? Welcome back, Anthony Stopel, yo, what's up? Uh, Rick Ross, what's up? The best savage, what's up, man? I got the new Goku on GP. Wait, it already came out. I just told you that. Oh. I told you he came out last night, right after the episode. Oh, I thought you meant like the no, he's the out. Like oh, literally, he's his out, banner out. is out. Oh, his crap. banner's out. No way. <laughs> Shoot, I think I might just have to make a GP account right now. Hey, just... friend, friend me, cause I just made mine. I'm rank eighty something more. Well, right I'm now. I'm gonna re-roll until it gets. <laughs> I don't wanna like farm. Oh, okay. Like yeah, I can't do that because I already farmed up the. Uh... The farmable versions for him, oh, okay. so I'm not about to do all that. That makes sense. Yeah, I think I might just have to let me open up the emulator. It's a good thing I have the emulator out now because I can just use the emulator instead of using my phone, like my main one. On my yeah, phone. that's what I'm doing. I'm using the yeah. emulator for JP. Nice. All right, let me put the volume down on this. Let me get to the JP side and use the Q up. All right, another filler episode next. What do you mean? You think next week is gonna be a filler episode with hits? I don't know. Um, nah. I love to eat all yours. <laughs> Close out a Kit Kat bar, chicken nugget. Nice. Yeah, I'm pretty you... back. It's been a long time. Not really. Yeah, of course. Wait. Is your chat not popping up on your layout, like your screen? My bad. <laughs> My bad. There you go. We're good. We're good now. Yeah, because I, I remember how I was gonna say I thought we were gonna do a video, but then I'm like, you know what, screw it, let's, do, let's just do the live stream instead. So I had the the layout for for um for video wise. That's why. Mm -hmm. All right. It's good, y'all. I'm freaking back. It's been a long time. Not really. DBZ winner of DBZ winner has been so mean, like. For the past like two three weeks now like dang god like it what's up man hit becomes as strong as jerry not even close to a filler mm. i wouldn't th i wouldn't say next week is a filler nah sup what up skeleton can y'all friend me i have him as my lead uh i currently don't have a gp one right now um i'm gonna reroll until i get him then and then if you if y'all want, I'll add you guys. I'll add you all. So yeah. Lord Fourth, you're cool. Yo, it was awesome. When Barris was shocked when Goku went into self movement. Hell yeah. But at the same time, he didn't use it to the max. Best episode ever. Limit br limited breaker. What's up, man? Welcome to the stream. And yes. Oh man. All right. So, huh? Where are we gonna start with this, Devin? We we gotta start with everyone's favorite character. <laughs> bring, 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 bring it! Oh my God! Like that! Oh, she was so annoying. I was like, "Come on, can just someone just knock her out?" Like, dang! Oh man, I was like, "Come on, Goku, you turn blue, just knock her out." And then the moment when she lands on Jiren, you know, I'm like, "Oh please, Jiren, just just kick her out," you know, just kick her, and that's it. But no, I'm like, ah, oh, freaking. Thinking we began like, ugh. and then her her wish is a little lame. Like her wish for the Super Dragon Balls. For reals. What up, Tyler? Cole, I think that's uh, oh, <laughs> yeah. Cole, what's up? Welcome to the stream. But don't worry, I'm only here for the review. It's not really a review. It's more just us. <clears throat> you know, it's it was so pumped. We and Devin, we need to talk about it. You know, and yeah. <laughs> 
Uh, Ultra Instinct Power wasn't fully used. True. Yep, the name is not that bad. Oh, it kind of. You know how. Ah, uh, alright. No, I'm, I'm getting too forward on myself. <laughs> alright. Um. Well, first of all, welcome back, everyone. Um, I know today was supposed to be FIFA Sunday, and then I told everyone in Discord I was going to push it back on Saturday only so I can rest on Sundays. But you know what? Screw that. I'm going to just maintain Sundays, FIFA Sundays. Just today, this week, you know, this episode was just too damn good. We need, you know, I w I, I'm okay to postpone my FIFAs, you know, my passion for FIFA aside for this ep these two episodes, you know. Because that's how good it was. The entire time I had goosebumps. Like, Jesus. Why have a feeling this conversation is going to draft into another topic? Dang, Kirito. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. Who knows? Oh, so the animation. We've already spoke about this, but that animation. Dang. <laughs> oh, you know. Before we get too full of ourselves, not full of ourselves, but ahead of ourselves, let's let's go little by little, you know, how it starts, pretty much. Okay. Unless, so unless, they, yeah. All right, you go ahead. Go ahead. You're the guest. Feel free. So I just want to know, what what is your personal opinion on Ribri right now? <laughs> she needs to get out. Like, you know, <laughs> Universe 2 needs to be eliminated so Ribri can just be gone. Because, oh my god, like, it felt filler for me. I'm like, this first... <clears throat> Nine episodes was a filler for me. I'm like, okay, can someone just knock her out, please? I don't care if it's anyone. I don't care if it's Pickle. I don't care anyone. Just someone knock her out. Like, Jesus. Oh, Ribriana. See, part of me feels like that, but at the same time, I want Ribriana to stay in because I know if she goes out, that's the rest. Because she's clearly the strongest person in, uni in that universe. Exactly. That's all. I, like. I want her out. That way, it but I want, can part of me wants to see what happens after the tournament of power. If certain universes get to stay as long as they have members like if that happens like my speculation if that yeah. happens yeah because i really want jamie's to teach gohan something because yeah. they they teased it jamie's the uh, yard rat oh right right right. they teased it yeah, in the last it's like the, the next time i see you i'm uh <clears throat> i'm gonna give you i'm gonna show you my technique when we all know it has to be the the instant transmission, or what? And I would love new. for it to be something more than just instant transmission. Yeah, then. unless it's something new, that'd be pretty cool too. But that's that's the only reason I would want her. Other than that, she can go. Because <laughs> <laughs> she has been really annoying with all this love, love, love yes, stuff. Yes, <laughs> you, yes, you have no idea, man. Like, <clears throat> I'm just like, oh, please, someone, just someone, knock her out. That's all I want. And then it got worse when she had a discussion with Goku about her objective. For the uh, Super Dragon Balls. Yeah. Her wish was basically, she wants to become a god. Specifically a goddess of love. Loved by mortals from each and every universe. Exactly. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Didn't expect that, but all right. That's that's. I was, that's, that's I cool. was like, that sounds exactly like what she would want to be. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was surprised. Goku threw me for a loop when, he's, when, they, uh, when she asked her, what about you? And, you know, it's like, oh, I don't know, something probably for Chi Chi or, uh, that um, ex that's or what's what it I called, or Goten. I was like, oh, I was like, oh, I was like, whoa, that, that, <laughs> Goku, really? That threw me for a loop, because, especially since that was his first response. And then he's like, oh, if, or, or anything, you know, I can just ask for someone stronger to fight, blah, 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 and stuff like that. You see, that I expected, you know, from him. But the yeah. first part, the first part threw me for a loop. I'm like, oh, okay. So you, I mean, obviously he cares, but you know, it's it feels nice whenever they show him that he cares for his family. You know, like in the Zamasu arc, you know, where um when he went all rage after finding out that he killed uh, Zamasu killed uh, his family, you know, and stuff like that. So yeah. <clears throat> and then he didn't even have to have anything big to happen to speak about them like that. So. I'm exactly. pretty sure that was refreshing for a lot of people. Yeah. Who always want to talk about my man Goku <laughs> and say he ain't a good father and husband. For real. When he always has them in mind. Exactly. That proved it right there. Exactly. <laughs> oh, man. But that, that, he don't need that. He already yeah. got the strongest opponent, but we're we going to hold off on that. Oh, right. Exactly. <laughs> uh, I got a theory that Goku is probably going to come back <laughs> strong when he gets back into Ultra Instincts. Probably, Zai, most likely. Is that Dev Chen? Yes, it is. Hi, White Substance. What up, Goku Goku Black? Welcome back. Average Normie, 
What's my rank? Um, don't know. I haven't really been focusing on on Dokkan honestly, like as much. I haven't been going that <laughs> ham, you know. But yeah, I haven't um, been going ham either. My ass, you're in the top nine hundred, <laughs> man. <laughs> I'm I'm in the top eight hundred now. Oh goddamn! Yeah. <clears throat> no one's really playing honestly. Honestly, no. They, one's they really are playing. not. Yeah, that's why I'm just like I'm. I've been casually going. Like I haven't even been trying. I just casually get on and go. Yeah. That's how I know a lot of people ain't trying that Dude, hard. I haven't played in a full day, and I'm still local number nine. Like, wow. Wow. Exactly. I Someone knocked me down from six to nine. Oops. Someone knocked me down from six to nine, but, I mean, I, I've been stood as local number nine for the entire full day. So, it's like, without even me playing. Until right now, pretty much. Dude, why yeah. you be hyped about seeing a bunch <clears throat> of kids running around on Zoo? I think, mean, yeah, okay, I'll get the three kids, okay. Anyone at Elder Kite here? Uh, yes, I'm pretty sure I should. <clears throat> no, no, I lied, I lied. I don't think so. Um, <laughs> what about the music, though? Why? Uh, okay, they're talking about their own thing. All right. But yes, that threw me for a loop, honestly. I was really surprised. I was like, yes, yes. I like I like moments like these. As, like, uh, for example, like with, uh, this is totally not, not in the <clears throat> same realm, but, you know, a different anime, One Piece, with Luffy. You know, whenever he acts like a captain, that I like. I, it's refreshing for me as well. You know, so that that is the same aspect with um, with Dragon Ball Super when Goku shows and cares that he ha he cares for his family and he loves his family to the point where he he would he he his first response was <clears throat> I will do some I will wish something for Chichi or Goten. You know, putting his um uh. <clears throat> What he will want, which will be, you know, fighting someone, find, uh, finding someone else stronger, you know, putting that aside and focusing on the family first. That I like. I like that because it shows his character. You know, it's not just all about oh, Goku's just bronze. You know, like he just wants fight and that's it. No, no, no. He has, he has. Um, obviously, he loves his family, but you know, it's, it, I just like it when the, the animated, when the animation or or in the manga, regardless, it shows that. I like that. Because it shows the true character of the main character like that. But yeah. Most definitely. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. But I was fine. You just wanted to be seen. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Let's see. All right. But okay, so it, next. Uh, yeah, Basically, next uh, what do you think about the Ruby Ass transformation? Like the whole Wings effort? I want people to know that. Basically, it's not a ripoff of Choji. <laughs> a lot of people, that was my first like thought. That was that literally that. my first thought. When I'm like, oh, cool, a Choji. Nice. Like, if everything. everything. Sailor Moon, the characters from that universe are basically made yeah. in honor of Sailor Moon. Yeah. yeah. And they had a transformation. She had a transformation with wings. So yeah. that's basically what that's from. It's not actually from Choji. <laughs> I just wanted to, to state that. Uh, I mean, also when when that happened, you know how she got energy from the one girl that got knocked out already. That also hinted that oh, okay, now we kind of get a hint of how Goku might get uh the the spirit bomb because even though I'm going a little forward by myself, because I would have thought you know they would have not like I would have thought Zeno or the priest would have said oh you can't use. You know, someone energies from someone that already got kicked out, or maybe only the in, in that's still alive in I mean not alive in the tournament, pretty much. You know, still fighting, but yeah. that kind of hinted that oh, okay, if Ribian was able to do it, I can see where now Goku's gonna get the energy for it. You know, yeah, because a lot of people thought that that should have been illegal. Exactly, but but it, a lot of people didn't even speak about how Ribian did the same thing before. Exactly. Goku did it. It's like, because they did that first, it, it gave us the hint. Like, okay, now we know how Goku's going to do it. Or how, how he's going to get it. Because, I mean, they're in the in the no void, I think, right? I think that's what it was called. Was it? No, I'm confusing. I think I'm now confusing terms with Digimon. Fuck. Oh, <laughs> um, wow. Damn. Pl but yeah. Plan that has changed your mind. <laughs> it has. I love that game. Anyways, off top. <laughs> it's not even reading the chat. Yes, I am. Jeez, DBZ winner, why are you gonna be so negative? Relax, DBZ winner, relax. Even the Goku was fully recovered and got the Ultra Instant back. Nice. Uh, I didn't even watch subs. Nice. Psy and check your friends ranking. <laughs> Alright, I will. Oh, I think I'm your friend in Dokkan. I don't know. All right. hey, Goku guys, loves his Goku. family because Pan is in the, is it? <laughs> Lightning and Pan. 
This yeah. is still a thing. Yeah. After all this time. Of course. Of course, man. It's 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 lightning. Would you expect? It's him with his pawn. It's sad because like, um, I, people were like, oh, why not? Why not? Why doesn't he show love for Gohan? But I mean, like, he can't. Nah, he really didn't show it at this episode. But it's like, at least we know that he does love his family. Sure, he prefers Goten, you know. But I mean, there's. Well, like, he did say sons. Yeah, he, he did say, say sons. sons. Yeah, but. We all know that, well, in my personal opinion, I feel like he prefers Goten more, just because, you know, he, Goten yeah. is still really attached to his dad more compared to Gohan, since he has his own family, you know? And the fact that Gohan, I mean, Goku is more attached to Pan than Gohan, <laughs> but and then in that aspect, it makes sense as well, because the whole gram. See, I would, I would say that, but the difference is, when Goten was born, Goku wasn't there, whereas when Gohan was born, Goku was. Exactly. So it's, with Goten, it's more like making up a lot of time mm-hmm. that he didn't have when he first... Because that, that's a big thing, to miss your child's birth. Yeah. Look, at look, look everyone. Freaking <laughs> Devin right here, rank 814. This guy. Are you looking at my rank? <laughs> I'm looking at my friends. Yeah, your boy up there. You're number one in mine, though. Dang. Of course. Damn. What Damn. friend could possibly be better? <laughs> I can't really tell, but is my profile my SSB or the Ultra Instinct? It's the Ultra Instinct form. Gogo will probably be like Ginka or Tyson with the Bladers. Dang, I'm like way ahead of everybody on your friends. <laughs> or like the people counting on him, like Teaching gets the spirits, Bardock not involved. Sign, do a PS4 stream now. <laughs> I can beat you at Xeno 2. Got like another day. You know, that's so what you, you really could have done. Yeah. <laughs> I know, but screw we it. We didn't even think about that. I didn't think about it, to be honest. <laughs> screw it. Oh, well. We already started, and I don't feel like switching games. Because my right now on FIFA, I'm on Ultimate Team. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 14, Devin's a natural. Yep. Of course. <laughs> Guys, I don't think I can beat Jiren. I used to be number one of my friends. We're a winner. Dang. <laughs> oh man right, let's see i'm trying to remember this off memory <laughs> what was after that no that that was it it just started with the whole fight <laughs> That's, oh yeah with goku yeah, rip yeah, and all yeah this. it was after that the whole them talking what was your wish for and stuff like that and then then can i just say goku did not struggle at all with Ribrian. He was oh, in real. base form. And I know. He struggled at. He did not struggle. Exactly. I just wanted to make that a point. Because that's that's a big thing. And just to show you. Because Ribrian not weak. She's not weak. I know that. <laughs> she's annoying, but she's not weak. And the fact that Goku in base holding back power. Whew, you you're right on that. Cr- Ribrian is annoying. <laughs> Everyone in chat <laughs> can agree. Markel Johnson, what's up, man? Welcome to the stream. What's good? Not much. Just here with Devin talking about Super. No, he was healing me. Maybe. Oh, okay. You, you guys are ahead. Uh, I will. I mean, I'm gonna read that, but I won't say that. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I might leave later. Already, DBZ winner. Well, you have school, so it's cool. It's understandable. Oh, that's true. Yeah, we forgot about that. Yeah. I, well, I definitely forgot. Then again, you, know, you, you have any been, form of school. You haven't been here at all, though, too. So. <laughs> So you might have forgotten since, you know, you've been busy with work, with his choreography and stuff. I'm only level 113. I'm sorry. I'm trash. <clears throat> Silence. What are you talking about? All right. <laughs> so I love Krillin in this episode for the analysis that he gave out. Pure in details. That, know, that I enjoyed. <laughs> enjoyed. That just shows you how close Krillin and Goku exactly. are. Exactly. You know, they Krillin, aren't Krillin best friends for no reason. TM didn't understand that first. Master Roshi didn't have to speak on it. Krillin exactly. was just giving you everything. Exactly. <laughs> and he has he has so much faith in Goku. Is this? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna jump a little bit ahead of myself, but that that moment where he's like, "Oh, don't worry, you guys. He can still do. Tw- he still has. Uh, by now, he I'm pretty sure he's mastered twenty times Kaioken with the Super Saiyan Blue." And Beerus comes in like, "He's been already using it." <laughs> no, no, we, um, that was weak. Oh, was it? I thought it was both. Yeah, it was Whis. I, I thought it was Beerus. My bad. Dang. Don't try. Don't talk trash about power of low. Oh, 
<laughs> Power of love. <laughs> <laughs> I still like their god though. I don't have a problem with the god. Just Ribriane. <laughs> it, it is Ribrian, honestly. Like Jesus, she just needs to get knocked out. I would be, oh imagine somehow imagine Ribrian is still like alive in the end. Like her her universe survives because she's still there. I'm like oh my god. I just want that universe to be away just so they can get rid of Ribrian. She's so annoying. <laughs> Okay, moving on. Let's, let's uh, get past Ribbian already. I, she's that annoying. She was that annoying for me. It's like those nine minutes. It could have just been Goku could have just turned Super Saiyan Blue in an instant, knocked her out, and started off within five minutes against Jiren. But no, no, Toei was like, let me give you at least a good ten minutes of Ribbian. They, they, they got to give you an appetizer. Exactly. They are. They they had to show you that already. It's not even a fight yet, and the animation already 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 on fleet already. Um, uh, Markel, we're talking about the na- we're talking about the latest episode. If you don't want to be spoilers, like in the thumbnail, there's spoiler <clears throat> warnings. So if you haven't seen it, feel free uh, to leave for now and come back later once you see it. So yeah. I'm um, pretty sure Markel's. What's up, gameplay master? Welcome back to another stream. How's your day going so far? But yeah. Um. But no, I honestly did love the analysis. You know, saying that. Oh yeah. You know, it's it's what masters martial artists do. Ma- martial, eh, I can't even speak. Martial, martial, eh. master martial artist. There you go. I had to say it slow. What mm. they do, you know, they That's a shame. They, when they start off base, he's just you know going ham. <laughs> it just it reminded me <laughs> in that moment. It reminded me when when it was Vegeta against Cell, perfect form. You know how he was doing all those punches and Cell is just like taking it like, okay, just standing there, you know? That, 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 that moment, that reminded me of that flashback right there. But anyways, yeah, he goes from Super Saiyan then goes to Super Saiyan 2, which I'm not surprised he didn't go Super Saiyan 3. I kind of wish he did though, just for the aspect to show uh, Kale and Kalifa that there's another transformation above Super Saiyan 2 and this is how it looks like, you know? Um, unless... No, that's that's just me. I, I personally like the Super Saiyan 3 transformation, that's why. But anyways, and then he goes to Super Saiyan God. And then when Krillin says, yes, you see, he made Jiren move with one finger. Sure, he blocked it with one finger. Just like when Goku did with Trunks in the future with his sword. But still, that shows Jiren that, okay, in this form, I have to move at least one finger. And then, he goes, he goes base, right? Afterwards, then he goes blue. Right? I don't think he went red to blue. I think he went red to base, then blue, right? If I yeah. Know. Yeah, okay, yeah. And then, whew, <clears throat> he finally makes um, Jiren move, you know, and stuff like that. And then, he randomly throws the Kaioken in there and actually lands a hit. Which I'm like, oh, I heard Jiren take a hit because you, you know how you hear, like, oof, or whatever, the, the whole, like, him taking a hit. I'm like, okay, mm-hmm. good, good, <laughs> that's, that's my boy, Goku, turning that Kaioken out of nowhere, so, you know, surprising him. And stuff, but yeah, out of out of before he goes to full times Kaioken, what did you enjoy the most of that part though? Probably the same part you did. You enjoyed if it was the same part where he was just going through the transformations. Exactly, I like that. Uh, also, side to side with Krillin just going with the analysis, like it. It, it was, was a lot like when he did it when with Boo, but it was different exactly. at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. And the way he did it, like him going from Super Saiyan to Super Saiyan 2, the way he did like Super Saiyan 2 is still beautiful. Yeah. Every time I see Super Saiyan 2, it's just like, ah, this is just perfection as a Super <laughs> Saiyan form right there. Uh, and then yeah. a lot of people didn't know that he would actually use God. Oh, yeah. Um, I, I unless, they, they, unless they didn't see that last episode where he did came in and helped hit just with Super Saiyan God. Yeah. Well, no, they didn't expect them to like transform again into God against Jared. Oh, like no. most people thought he would go Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan two, and then just be break out blue. Nah, I would have. And thought... then probably they probably would have thought he would try to do the whole thing where he switches between God and blue again. Mm, okay. But the way he did it, just it was just mad. That's why I was a little bit annoyed that he didn't go Super Saiyan three because I'm like, come on, you always go from one, two, then red or blue, mostly blue. But you even did the red form. I'm like, just just throw in three. Just 
Just See, show the thing me. about three is though it's so unstable. I know, I know that, but still. So Sign is going FIFA mode and not reading comments. No, I'm reading it. I'm reading it. You guys, I'm reading it. I'm just I may not be saying it out loud, but I'm reading it. Don't worry. I play Sonic Generation, it was Sonic. Well, I'm fine with the same person in the world tournament. Don't know. I know winner. Oh, okay. Here's the turn about Dokkan. Makes sense. Oh, uh, you were saying? My bad. Where were we at? Uh, you were saying how beautiful. Uh, oh, no, no. People were. People didn't expect uh, him to go um, uh, red again. Oh, yeah. God. Yeah. Against Jer. Yeah. So that was. That, it was nice that he did. I thought he was going to. Because, I mean, like. I'm like. <laughs> obviously, I knew he was going to skip three. Like how you said, it's unstable. And plus, it takes a lot of his stamina, if I recall. Yeah, um, exactly. Yeah. So there's no point. Um, so. I figured he was gonna go red because I mean I don't think he's gonna go just directly to blue and start off. I because I I I'm pretty sure, like how Krillin was saying, any master martial artist wants to wants to go step by step, you know, little by little to see how he stacks up against them. So it only made sense for him to go red. But then again, I mean there are people that would be surprised that oh he went back to red, you know, since we we've only seen it what <clears throat> that one moment in tournament and ever since then. It was in the Beerus arc, the um, Battle of Gods arc, pretty much. So yeah, I can see why. Since we, since you know, Toei, the anime, animation-wise, they don't, we don't really see red compared to the manga. That's much. And can I, I, I like the fact that they can speak telepathically like that. The God of Destruction and Jiren, and I guess I, I'm assuming he's. I don't know if it's just with Jiren he can do that, or if it's everybody. I'm pretty sure that his everyone. Team. It's just that why would he talk to everyone when he can just talk to the number one guy, you know? Can I just say, this whole Jared, Jared and this really made it seem like Ta Ta Topo is just nothing at this point. Dude, for reals. <laughs> like, oh, I, I really dude. thought he was a juggernaut at first. I know. But see, seeing Goku like this, even seeing Goku like this, just makes it look like he's just way far above even Top Topo at this point. Oh, yeah. I mean, even even Jiren, you know, we're getting ahead of ourselves. But even Jiren said, you know, if he puts his hand, I'll be like, just just stop. You know, it's it's worthless. It's oh like, no, it's you, you skipped a lot. Yeah, that's what I, said. I would just say that part and that's it. We'll come back. We'll come back to that. Oh man. DBA was something with people to get winter born wet. DBA. I don't. Know. I don't get it. Okay. Sure. Anyways. Um, where were we at? Let's see. We were. So I, oh, I really want to know you, the part with with Goku Woods going through the transformations, hitting uh, Jiren. Yeah. Was he actually hitting Jiren, or was Jiren moving so fast that it looked like that he was just blocking all the all of Goku's punches at that point, or was he actually letting Goku hit him, and it was just having no effect? I, I don't know. There was two things. That's that I was the one thinking. part I'm confused about at that point. Because later in the anime, and well, we we gonna get to that. But yeah, at, at that point, it it looked at first like Goku was hitting him, and it was just having like it looked like Kale. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, like it was having no effect. But mm -hmm. I don't know. I thought of two things. One, like how you're saying, like it just he just let him, and it, it had no power. Like his his he knew his strength, and he was like, you know what? Let, let me just take it. Let's see where he stacks up, you know, against me. I, that's or, what I thought of or, it. Or were or, we looking at it from Goku's ex perspective where before he went, because once he went to God, we saw Go uh, Jaren block him with a finger. Like yeah. we actually start seeing yeah, Jaren's yeah, hand move. Exactly. So I'm wondering if we were actually seeing it from Goku's perspective, where from Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan 2, he couldn't really see Goku, Jaren blocking him. Oh, that's true. True. And then once he went God, his speed increased so much that now he can actually see Jiren block him. Dang. Dude, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Because it looks like... Cause... If, if that's the case, <clears throat> damn! <laughs> Power something, what's up? Welcome back to another stream. Uncle Tachi, welcome back. Hero, welcome back. Hey, Uncle Tachi in the building. Yep, Hero. <laughs> how, well, I love how you said the last time with his, all of his names. He just made a sentence out of it. It's like, damn. Devin. Yeah, I don't even know what I say. I did, that was uh, just a trigger. I know. I was like, I, I read something he said, and I was like, okay, I got you. I got you with this right here. 
for real. And it just came like it came out of out nowhere. Somewhere. Exactly. It's like <laughs> damn. All right. Anyways, off topic. Let's go back to let's go back to Super. You know. Oof, I'm still getting goosebumps just by talking about it. Damn. We even we, we skipped we, before they before he even did the transformation and the whole sweat drop. And then he just oh, powered up and base form and then shot the command. Yes. Man. And then Jiren's energy created a force field. That was awesome to that's, see. That's what I was thinking too. Like, you know how when he was taking the punches, like how you said there, there's that aspect in Goku's, in Goku's perspective. Or maybe it was just he was landing the punches, but it was just hitting the force field that he has around, but just of his pure energy, you know? Like how it was with the Kamehameha, uh, pretty much. Um, but who knows? Who knows? Why is See, I would say that, but it looks so much different from yeah. when he used the Kamehameha. That's the only thing. Yeah. Because it actually looked like Goku's punches were landing, as as opposed to you could see the space in between the Kamehameha and mm-hmm. Jiren. Yeah. But no, and then right off the bat, when he just does his eyes, he op- he's he looks no, he just opens his eyes, stares at him, and just all that energy that he has. Just punches him and all that all over his chest. I was like, God damn! That moment when he yeah, did that—that's that, when that's when I thought about it. And I was like, maybe he, when he does that, that's just him increasing his speed in an instant. Damn! If that's to the point where you just can't see it because it happens so instantaneously. God. Maybe cosmic. Because even uh, se- even seventeen mentioned it, and he was like, he hit him multiple times in an instant. Yeah. At that point. Whew! Freaking Jin. The way he started off, you know, the way they build Jiren, the way he starts off, it's like, god damn, what a beast. I mean, to the point where even, this, we're going a little bit back, when he, when, when, um, what's the god destruction's name? The clown guy? Because there's different ways to pronounce it. Yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it, so yeah. I'm not even going to butcher it. Uh, <laughs> yeah, well, him, <laughs> god destruction universe 11, when he pretty much has to go after, you know, Goku, start off with son Goku, the fact that you, you see everyone... The pressure, his pressure, his freaking energy, just stopping everyone from their tracks and just looking. And we're to the point where Freeze is, oh, my, my, we the uh, a monster or a beast. A something. monster is on the yeah. move. Yes, exactly. I was like, you know. Like the monster is on the move yeah, right like, now. like, you know that she really gets up there when Frieza, you know, kind of compliments the opponent. Because, you know. And even Beerus yeah. was unsettled a little bit. Like, his thought was. Is that coming from one person? So Jiren's energy must feel like mil- like a whole bunch of people just releasing energy at once. Exactly. It That's reminds crazy. Me, it reminds me of the going off topic a bit. The Yu Yu Hakusho, you know, in the in the dark tournament where the Tokoros goes up against this um uh the guy with the giant axe and the guy with the football, the one that was gonna uh, try to get uh, Yusuke when he was asleep, but he gets saved by one of the the, the yeah, yeah. It reminds me of that. You know how all that you see all the energy coming out, but it's just from one guy. You know, there, it reminds me of that. But yeah, everyone's watching Goku, Lauren fight. And Lauren, hashtag perfect. <laughs> <laughs> what is in the screen? Oh my God, my Vegeta hashtag Ultra Instinct. Yup. See, that's the thing, though. Nobody wanted to move. Yes. Like they were everyone was focused so much on Jiren and Goku at that point. Exactly. Because every it was clear at that point who Those, the two top dogs yeah, exactly. were at that point. Ex- exactly like how the, the Supreme Kai of Universe Eleven. I can't remember <clears throat> their damn names. And I don't want to butcher um the God Destruction thing because there's ways to pronounce it. I don't know. Yeah. What, I don't know the correct way. Um but yeah, even the Supreme Kai has told them like yeah, this is gonna. It's all gonna come down to these two. If Jiren can knock out um, Goku, since everyone knows how strong Universe uh, Seven's leader is, oh, not leader, but Son Goku is. If they see how he can't even compare to Jiren, they're just gonna lose the will to to fight. But when he said it, I'm like, I don't think so. I don't think they'll lose the will. I think that's just gonna make them want to get all together and try to do something. Exactly what happens. You know, getting ahead of Yeah, they were about to try to yeah, jump exactly. all three of them. Exactly. It was about to be three against everybody. Exactly. <laughs> but uh, it's it's funny. Jiren's character is someone who's... He's, he's such a good character because... 
he he doesn't over he doesn't underestimate his opponent no matter who it is which what a fi a complete fighter should do like you know and how like he's, always you can tell he's just super confident in his yes. ability oh yeah whereas the the god of destruction his god of destruction is more cocky and jerk. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like so that's it's a difference. You can see the difference between someone who's confident about their selves and somebody who's cocky about someone else. Yeah. Because he just looked at it like Jared Duran got all this. This 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 ain't nothing. Exactly. <laughs> oh man. Where Jaren from the beginning, like from the very begin from the moment Jaren and Goku interacted probably the very first time. When he says hi. <laughs> there was a res <laughs> Yeah will get lost exactly. it's like it's like a there was already a respect factor from jiren to goku already from that point yeah because jiren you could tell and as the fight continued to unfold jiren gained more and more respect for goku mm -hmm. especially since he was just always in the background well not in the background but always just watching see he was watching goku the, the entire, entire time. time exactly uh alfredo what's up welcome to the stream welcome to the stream zeal what's up welcome welcome Who's, who's yeah, hyped for his speed, Jiren? We'll talk about that. It's funny that. how unbothered... What? It's, it's funny how unbothered 17, 18, and Frieza, Frieza were compared to everyone else in the arena. <laughs> like, they, it was not one time where they showed, like, oh my gosh. Oh, like, know. Frieza was like, Frieza looked like he was getting excited. 17 and 18 looked calm the whole time. Well, that's that's but how you they see always Gohan, and, yeah, yeah. With Gohan, Piccolo, and them were a little unsettled. Vegeta yeah. had his moments where he like shit. Exactly. <laughs> you know, she gets serious when Vegeta comes in and be like, "Fuck, can can he beat him? Yeah, use your full strength and be like, ho ho ho, dang." But no, th this is why I love Frieza. He's just he just get he's like Goku in that aspect. <clears throat> like he he gets excited when it comes down to fighting more stronger opponents. You know. Um, mm -hmm. And then, and then the androids. I've always loved the androids. You know, um, I love Seventeen much more now in Super because we got more of him compared to yeah. You get to actually then. see who yeah. he is now. Yeah, exactly. Compared to how it was in in Z, you know, it was just oh up until the cell, and that was it. You know, we we had our moment with Eighteen. You know, we got to see her ever since then, and now that we get to see Seventeen now, I like that. Yeah. You know, and 17. even though GT wasn't the greatest thing in the world, it made you still like Eighteen. Even more because of what she did when 17 super 17 murdered krillin exactly but you know that's gt none of us talk about gt you know because it's hey, we got we got to speak about gt especially right. when people were saying gt is better than super the animation from z and gt oh, are better yeah. than super after this fight i don't want to have nobody know. say exactly those Any animation. Punches. This is the best animation in Dragon oh, Ball. Oh yeah. Period. By period. far, by far period. the best one. By far the best one. Those punches that Mirren threw without moving were awesome. You mean Jiren Sage? Welcome back, Sage. Welcome back. Uh, intro music. Kofun Zuzo. Uh, I can't. I don't wanna. And the music, the scores in this oh, episode yes. was great too. I, the music that threw me, was amazing. That threw me off because you know how we usually don't get when it comes to battle scenes, we don't really see we, we hear the like you know the themes and stuff like that, but we don't really hear like lyrics. And it kind of threw me off. I'm like I only I, I only expect that through movies, you know, especially in the dub version, you know, for uh, Dragon Ball. Um, but yeah, that threw me off, and I liked it. I'm like the 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 score was so it fit this episode so well. I was like yes. And everything, even though there was, it was even though it's the same thing, but just the different type of score it had, the tone and everything, it just fits so well. Jesus, <laughs> man, you and Devin are into this for you real. Uh, that's exactly <laughs> what I was reading right now. <laughs> oh, look, lightning, lightning with the GT and the heart face, of course, <laughs> the heart eyes, you know, because his pan gets shined in GT. <laughs> I mean, hey, Pond I, is. In, I just want to say one cool. thing that. Okay, no, let, let's not go to that yet, because we're right. not, we not finished. We <laughs> not. Let's let's get to the spirit bomb, because we, we pretty much passed the whole Kaioken. Yeah. Well, did, we hit, yeah. did we even touch on Kaioken times 20? Not really, because we were still kind of about them clashing in the beginning, you know? Pretty much, well, I mean, the whole clashing, it was just them back and forth. Well, not really back and forth, it's just okay. Goku I mean, tries. I, when do you think Goku actually started using times 20 instead of times 10? 
right off the bat in the beginning where he realized that he started getting his ass beat, you know. Getting, really? Yeah. Oh, I feel like okay. that's how it was. I didn't me. think he did it. I honestly didn't think he used times 20 until I think he was still in times 10 when he grabbed on to the ring when Jaren almost knocked him out. And then when he got back up and then he went times 20. That's how I looked at it. Mm, okay. Like he might have been using times twenty the whole time. I wouldn't. Or, or maybe, surprised maybe Goku he just did times. Yeah, maybe he just did times twenty. Like in those blink moments when we see the aurora of Kaioken. Maybe that that was only the time he did times twenty, and the rest he just took to times ten, like how you said. And then once he got, he was about to be knocked out. He comes back. Then he went to time um, times twenty. You're right. Maybe I th- I think that's more possible now. Because definitely when he got hit by those punches, instant punches, punches, multiple yeah. jumps, yeah. he was definitely in times 20 at that point. Yeah. I like how serious this episode was. Cyborg, man. There's... G- GT is child abuse. <laughs> it kind of was like, low-key, though. <laughs> well, then again, at the same time, Sale versus Gohan was kind of child abuse, too. Yeah. <laughs> And Goku just let it happen. It's fun. Dragon Ball Z a bridge is funny for that. I have, uh, I okay, so <laughs> yeah, you gotta see it. I, I don't uh, know what you're doing, man. Nah, it's not. It's not. It's not for me. You know, it's not for me. It's, it's like how we were talking about Hunter Hunter. It's not for me. Okay, now now let's get to the Genki Dama. Oh my God! I have never called the Spirit Bomb the Genki Dama me before. Me I'm about to start calling me it the Genki Dama. Me too, man. Me too. Like damn. <laughs> Oh, my mouse died. It was awesome to just see Jared. Goku is like, yo, this is not enough power. I'm going to need more time. And my man, Jared, is He's just like, like, you know, take your time. I'll wait. I'll wait. Take your time. If this is your best move. Like, take your I want time. I see you give me all your stuff. Exactly. Right Dude, when I'll he wait. said that, oh, my goosebumps, even were, well, there were even more the moment he said, I was like, damn. Yes, this this is this is why I expect Jiren to be, you know, like exactly. all the hype that we got. I didn't to be a coward at exactly. all. Exactly. Not to ambush Goku at all. Exactly. It was funny. I, I thought when Rip Rian was trying to uh, sneak attack I was Goku, about to it was say that. be Jiren who I, hits her. I was about to say that right now. The moment we said the sneak attack, I was like, oh, talking about sneak attacks. It's freaking Rip Rian. <laughs> oh, my God. But it's funny how every time Rip Rian tries to do something to Goku, Vegeta steps in. Yeah. <laughs> have you noticed that? Yeah, I have. <laughs> oh, man. But no, I, I like how you were saying. I I legit thought it was going to be um Jiren that was gonna step in to Ruby, and I thought okay, the moment he said, oh she, he's defensive, he's not he he has opening blah 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 and whatever. Let me let me let me attack him and sneak attack, you know. And I'm like oh maybe this is when Jiren's gonna knock her out and be like nope bye bye universe two. That's what I was hoping. Sadly it didn't happen, you know that 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 crushed my. Dream. Oh did you also notice that even though it's appropriate for. Like Team Seven, Team Uni- the Universe Seven team could actually lend their energy to Goku, oh, but I, but the again? angels, the eight, like how the whole Universe Seven team can lend their energy to Goku in yeah. Spirit Ball, but I, I'm assuming it would be cheating if Beerus and Luis oh, were trying yeah. to do it. Yeah, that's why that's why they didn't do it because I know yeah. some people probably in their minds were like, why didn't Beerus? But yeah, now that that, that would be well, too much. Only the people inside the tournament yeah, yeah. Would, would be appropriate. Exactly. For that. Yeah, because that would have been way too much power. Then you know, I was surprised. Yeah. I was I, I won't lie. I was surprised when Frieza was like, you know what? Oh, yo, Frieza was like, yo, yeah, I had yeah. nothing but bad memories. Yeah, there. exactly. <laughs> well, besides, I was gonna say that too. It's like before I go, like the whole the remembers of the whole planet Abbey can be like, oh, you know what? I'll lend you some energy, and then Vegeta with his pride be like. Screw that. <laughs> yeah, Vegeta wasn't having it. Yeah. I, I was surprised to see Frieza cooperate. And not Vegeta. Vegeta yeah, exactly. But That's at, the same, I don't, at the same time, I, I don't do know. see but, it. But Vegeta's mindset was probably, I don't got it. My stamina, I ain't trying to use my stamina like that. So. Exactly. It's like, you know, let but me stay this thing need it? Did you, I don't even think they needed Vegeta just for the. It must be nice having androids on your team. For and real, unlimited energy. Unlimited. The fact they even commented on that. Like, yeah, take all the energy you want, you know, and be like, and yes. a lot of people was confused whether or not their energy will actually count because of their androids. And it's like a difference between um, actual key and battle energy or something yeah, yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. By the way, Khalifa, welcome. It, welcome. It, it, it's confirmed that 
androids can give unlimited supplies of energy to Goku's spirit bomb. <laughs> Oh, man. I just like seeing that 17 and 18. I really want them to do some duo moves. That's what I, I'm waiting for in the tournament. I want, I want to new... see them do some duo stuff. Look at my title. What do you mean, Cauliflower? Cauliflower, the stream title has been updated to no spoilers. Oh, that's a little... Mm, too big for that. This is all about spoilers. <laughs> What the hell? You guys can change my title? What? I didn't even know that. Oh, is it through Nightbot? Yeah, Nightbot did it. Damn it. Damn it, Nightbot. Damn it, Cauliflower. <laughs> See, Cauliflower, you can't do that because then people are going to come in thinking it's not spoilers exactly. and we're already having a discussion. Exactly. <laughs> Feel notice, Markel. We see you, homie. All right. Is my title back to normal? <clears throat> See, I'm glad I said that because God like was yeah. I was like, I was thinking, why didn't they do it? <laughs> yeah, nah, because that, that would have been way too much power, honestly. And then I'm pretty sure the priest would have stepped in, but nope, nope. And yeah, uh, besides, so we can't spell nothing in the stream like the title says, saying, but there were humans at points in time. That is true. Mark, how you Alex roast? Hold up, Alex roasted uh, Uncle Tachi. I want who is the roast? I missed it. Uh, probably something about, um, Xbox. I'm gonna assume uh, okay. something about Xbox, yeah. Uh, isn't he coming to the light side now? Yes, Alex is coming to the light side next week, this Sunday, this hey. upcoming Sunday. Yes, all we need now is Uncle Tachi. This is why Sonic can't have nice things. Damn it, Kaifa, abusing freaking, um, the Nightbot. Is this why you want a Nightbot, so you can have total control? Without even me noticing. Is this what you want? <laughs> <laughs> but no. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure. We're getting ahead of ourselves. But I'm pretty sure. There's going to be another. Uh, Genki Dama. In my opinion. This time with everyone. That's in the. The area. Uh, the arena. You know. Um, I personally would have liked it better. If it did start it off like that. Like you know. Um, obviously Universe 7. And then like. I don't know where Universe 6. Raises their hand. And stuff like that. Besides maybe like hits. You know, because I'm pretty sure he would he would have been like uh, Vegeta he wanted to um, have some energy still left, you know, um, and then everyone else raises their um, their hands, give him an energy so they can prove to see how how much of a badass Jiren is to take everyone's the Genki Dama with everyone's energy in the tournament and still knock it back. Whew. It might be I would have liked that more, but this worked out, too. I think it makes more sense though for it yeah. to just be a universe seven thing because at that yeah. point it wasn't really everybody didn't really want to gang up on Jared or Goku. It was really basically whoever wins, we're probably going to all have to join together and beat. Yeah, I still feel like there might be another Genki Dama coming. Going, here. I, I, I don't see it. I don't see that happening. Now. I, don't, no, I don't see no, no. two of them. I feel like another one, but this time instead of throwing mm -hmm. it, he's just going to absorb it and take the energy. You know. Just like how he did in the... Which movie was it when he did that? Um, I can't remember what movie, but he did... I could have sworn he did a Genki Dama, and he just... He took that to himself, and he absorbed it, the energy. And that's how he defeated it in the movie-wise. I can't remember which movie, but yeah. Oh, uh, no. Who 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 are your mothers? Quote-unquote mothers, Lightning. <laughs> or did they delete that? Because I saw it at one point. And Khalifa said, to be honest, I didn't know Nightbot to that. <laughs> Uh, Nightbot over here, timing out, Markel, I'm sorry, Markel, careful with the links, by the way, um, but yeah, do you know my mother's Devin, or do you know White Lightning's mother's Devin, they're in no, here. that's what I was just saying, oh, okay. yeah, yeah, um, it's, um, it's Cauliflower and Kale, really, no, oh, apparently, they adopted, uh, <laughs> oh, something. okay, yeah, it just, it was just out of nowhere, <laughs> but why is it mother's? Oh, because it's Cauliflower and Kale. Like, you know, the Cauliflower in our chat and the Kale in our chat, you know? Mm hmm So, mothers, it could be, it's both of them, not just one. Because then I would have been Mother Cauliflower or Mother Kale. So it's a beat. Oh, so, okay, so, but they're not mothers. Together. So, yeah. it's just two different mothers. Yeah, yeah, it's two different mothers. They have, okay. Yeah. I thought it was a different thing going on. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought there were, was a relationship and they adopted the child. Oh, I don't but, know. Maybe. Is there? I don't that's know. That's what I was thinking about. But now I'm like, okay, that makes more sense. Yeah. Because you know, it's a lot of people who want that to happen, where it's Khalif and Kale. They want that to actually happen. But <laughs> but we know that it's just a big sis, little exactly. sis type it's, of relationship. Yep. Yep. Anyways, but back you to... got some freaks in back, the anime community. Yeah. Yeah. Back, let's go. Let's instead of we go off topic, let's come back to the center, the main topic. This episode, we, the, Genki Dama, the, the Genki Dama, the Genki Dama, the Genki Dama. God damn. Um, but <laughs> now, oh my god, do, dude, the Genki Dama sounds ten times more impactful than some low flimsy spirit bomb. Exactly. It's because <laughs> it's it's a Japanese word, you know. It's just it's just it comes out mad. It's, it's so a Genki Dama, you know, a Genki, Genki Dama. Dama. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I haven't spoken to Kel yet. Is Kel here? Let's find out. Let's see. Kel, are you here? No, she's not. Kel is not here at the moment. Um, what was I saying? Just imagine another arc with Ultra Instinct Goku being a regular thing. God damn. Oh, no. I, I have a couple of theories about that, but we'll, we'll talk about it at the end, pretty much. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a couple I'm of theories about, to about say that. Too. Yeah, I, I, we'll talk about it in the end. <laughs> Uh, okay, so now we're yeah. at the point where the struggle is happening. Oh, okay. Besides the spoilers, and we knew what was going to happen. I don't know if you kept with spoilers. Um, oh, yes. Okay, oh, yes. okay. Yeah, Um, I kept up with the spoilers. I didn't keep it fully, but I knew what was going to happen, at least with 109, because that was the only spoilers that we had. Um, Holy crap. An, almost an hour in, we've only been talking about 109, pretty much. <laughs> We not even all the way. We I only know. on episode one oh nine. Exactly. Still. We're only on one oh nine. Jesus. Uh anyways. <laughs> yeah, like I already knew what was gonna happen. So it wasn't gonna phase me that oh, you know, I still want it it still got to me because, you know, it's animated and stuff like that. But you know, he throws it down and everything. And he picks it up with one hand. It reminds me it it, it reminded me exactly what Trunks did with Frieza with the the whole um um what was it? Not Death Ball. Was it Death Ball? No, Nova. I think it was a Nova one. The Nova one. Um, he just picks it up with one hand, and he throws it back. And, he, and then that's when we see Goku go Kaioken times twenty, pushes it back. No, no, he goes blue first, right? Or does he go automatically? No, he went all the way in two. Okay. Like he, he didn't went, waste okay. no time. He went right, straight right, right, Kaioken right. times. Okay. Uh, and wait, some I'm people are still confused about why. Like some people don't still think it's kind of weird. That Goku can't use the spirit bomb in anything other than base form, but yeah. Krillin did speak on it, yeah. and it's actually yeah. been touched on before, like way before in Dragon Ball Z, why he can't be just in Super Saiyan or Kaioken and then use it. Yeah, because even even like he, he said so. Yeah, the malicious will will <clears throat> creep into him as well. Yeah. Um, which I was gonna say, um, if I recall, the Genki Dama works mainly for malicious people, right? For if they have malicious like not not thoughts, but you know purposes and stuff like that. Pretty much, it works on the. It's in the quote sense unquote, just like Gogeta Stardust Breaker. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, quote unquote, it goes pretty much as effective against the bad guys, I guess. You know, the fact now, there's that's I, why I, a lot of people were confused why he's using it against Jaren. Exactly, because technically Jaren's not a bad person. Exactly, uh, which I was getting, conf which I got confused on only one <laughs> part where I'm like, I see why you want to do the Genki Dama. One, I was kind of surprised that's his trump card. Um, I didn't expect that. I didn't expect the Genki Dama to be the trump card, but at the same time, I do expect it because he he hardly does it. You know, he did it with. And that's Frieza. his most powerful. Yeah. like that's his, clearly his most powerful. Yeah, move. exactly. He does it with Frieza. He did it with Frieza. He did it with Kid Buu, um, and now Jiren. Because I don't think there's been another one in at least canon arc wise. There hasn't been another time since he's done it. Um, I don't think so. Um, but yeah. Um, oh, and, you know what I just thought about. What. It might make sense, like even though it's it's, it's clearly never been, it's actually been confirmed that the Genki Dama can actually hurt somebody who doesn't have evil or maliciousness inside of them. Mm -hmm. For the fact that Gohan had to block it, when, yeah, uh, he was yeah. a kid, and yeah, if he wouldn't have blocked it, he would have got hit by it. Yeah. So uh, the question is like the question is like using it against Jiren with that much power. Maybe when it's not against somebody who's actually malicious, mm -hmm. it can't kill you. It uh -huh. can just hit, hurt, like. Like devastatingly hurt you, basically. <laughs> All right. Okay. Because that um, would make it would make sense if that's the case. Yeah. Because a lot of people are like, wouldn't if it would have hit Jared, would it have killed him? 
Like, technically, wouldn't that be a move to, for somebody to try to kill somebody? But clearly not. Okay. It probably would just hurt him. Yeah, because I was, I was confused when he did. I'm like, I, 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 I figured when he said Trump, I'm like, uh, I hope it's not the Genki Dama, but I'm like, it, this is the perfect sense where it, it might come now, you know? And But I'm like, I, I did, I, I was like one of those fans or one of those people. I'm like, why are you using it? He's not really evil or, you know, and stuff like that. It shouldn't really work, you know? But then I thought, well, Kid Boo was, uh, you know, evil, and he was able to bounce it back. So it came down to my thought, like how you were saying, uh, maybe it's not all about um, if it's malicious things. Uh, it just depends on your strength. If you can, if you can take it back, um, if you can keep bounce it back, because th- we all knew Jin was gonna bounce back, pretty much, um, like how Kid Boo did. Um, so when that happened. You see, we see him go. I'm getting off topic now. I can't even remember what was my point. I'm gonna just continue. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what your point yeah, is either. I, I can't even remember my point. I'm gonna just continue with the fact that yeah, <laughs> you know, we see him take it with one hand first, pushes it back, goes Kaioken blue <clears throat> times twenty, pushes it back. We see Jiren now go with two, and then out of nowhere, he's like, you know what? I don't even need my two hands. Let me just stare it down. I'm like, holy crap! When he did that, I was like, god damn. Well, see, the thing is that like, okay. I just want to say one thing first. Okay. Frieza's still the only person to tank a spirit bomb. <laughs> true, true. I was, I was going to think, oh, no, you're right, you're right. It's nice to see that Frieza still has something. Yeah. He's the only person to actually be able to tank a spirit bomb. Yep. <laughs> but that, that, as, 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 when it comes to that, a lot of people was like, oh, my God, so you're using the glare. But at the same time, at that point, it looked like Jaren realized at that point that he doesn't have to use his hands anymore mm-hmm. because basically he he clearly can see that Goku is at his limit at that point. Yeah. And Jaren is not the kind of person to go overboard. True. But the fact that this man can use a glare <laughs> <laughs> to send energy back is ridiculous. For real. And that big of a massive energy as well. Like, but the yeah, fact yeah. that the, at the same time, even though Jaren was clearly overwhelmingly more powerful than Goku. Was. Oh, hell yeah. Like, it's not even a question. Yeah. The fact that Goku was actually holding his own struggle, and it, I, the animation around the spirit bomb where it was, like, getting smaller, and then, bam, it got bigger. Like, you could actually see it um, being compressed inside of both of their energies. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. That part was beautifully animated, too. Oh, yeah. The entire, I love seeing the, the spirit entire... bomb do that. The entire animated animation shit was beautiful. From from once the episode one, once Ribrian popped up the screen, the, the anime was. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's this animation! Oh man. <clears throat> Fact, Jiren is an OP. I didn't say that. No, no, no. <laughs> she's trying to she's trying to clickbait um the streamer my stream. She's trying to change the oh, title. Oh, clickbait um, sound. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now I see that. Yeah, I'm okay. like, no, don't do it. Don't do it. Click, totally she said clickbait salad. Do it, mom. Uh, like, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, man. Fact, Karen is an OP. That's right. Nah, damn. After, so, after that episode, I don't, I don't know. Can I just man. say, it doesn't make sense. Somebody, if someone's OP, they can't be, um, what's Beaten. the word? Beaten. Overhyped. Oh, okay. A per- if you're, it's no such thing as a person. You can't be overhyped if you're OP. Yeah. Because a lot of people was trying, it was like a debate, and Geekdom actually spoke about this, where it was a lot of people saying they feel like Jiren is overhyped. Mm-hmm. Because of all, and this was before the episode, that Jiren is overhyped. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I but agree too. He I mean, no. clearly, he met, he, he not he, only met people's expectations, and he surpassed, surpassed he surpassed them. the expectations. Because we, we but, figured, yeah. You were saying. A lot of people loafed on Goku, on Goku. Wait, say that again? A lot of people loafed on Goku because of the spoilers. Okay. Because <laughs> the spoilers made it seem like Jiren just manhandled Goku in his in his in the in the transformation that yeah. we haven't gotten yeah, to yeah, yet. Yeah, but. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, because <clears throat> in the spoilers, it even says so too. You know, like the whole like, oh, twenty times Genki Dama, Goku Blue, and all that. It doesn't phase Jiren. And stuff like that. I was watching Geekdom. And, Which, and was, that part was true. Yeah, yeah. That, that was, pr- was yeah. accurate. 100%. Yeah. Um, but what's it called? Yeah, like, I, I can see why people thought that now. Yeah. But, I don't know. I I don't want to say he's 
OP. I, I don't want Toei or, or whatever them to bust out a move. Because, you know, at least we can, can we can we completely say 100% confirm that Jiren is the one person, one mortal human, one mortal that's even stronger than a god destruction? We confirmed it. Okay. Actually, in the episode, he did. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Can we, can we just say that that's been confirmed? Because people were saying, what if Toei freaking out of nowhere be like oh you thought jiren was hype you know because we you know how there's still four um four universes fighters that we still haven't seen and stuff like that yeah a lot of uh, like somebody thought some a lot of people thought it was somebody there was, outside uh, yeah of someone before. else's yeah i'm like but see the thing is when we said that statement before they even went to the tournament of power he was just saying a rumor that was yeah stated. exactly a rumor and then in the he episode didn't know who like who's everybody's teams was compiled of he didn't even know who the actual person was if it was that if that person actually existed. Exactly, because it was all a rumor. It was just a rumor for spread out of every year. Yeah, it was just a rumor. Yeah. It wasn't a fact. Nobody knew it was a fact. Mm-hmm. But see, at, now on that part, uh-huh. I really my thing is I really think that you know, they, that god of destruction actually fought Jern before and probably lost. Say that again. I think they're the god of destruction of that universe. Mm-hmm. Actually, fought Jiren before and probably lost. Okay. Or if he didn't lose, it was like I don't know. But you could tell by the his demeanor how confident. Like he when he stated that nobody who no matter who Jiren is up against, he will not lose. Yeah. That made me think this man lost to Jiren before. Mm. He had to because even the angel. The angel, when he said that, the angel was like, hmm. Like, she was like, hmm, really? Yeah. What does that mean? Mm, okay. Does uh, that mean you fought him and lost? Yeah. <laughs> Is that what you're <laughs> saying right now, homie? Dang. And I ain't see this? I never knew about this? <laughs> All right. Uh, Cauliflower, do me a favor. Don't change the title. Don't <clears throat> change the clickbait. Please. Uh, unless you want me to step in and get rid of your mouth for like 300 seconds. Is it 300 seconds of a timeout? I think it's 300 seconds. I've done it before. <laughs> I've done it before. People think I'm nice to call it for that. I don't let her. I don't put my foot down on her. No, I've done it before. I will we'll do it again. It. What? Mm. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, anyways. Um, back to the, the whole thing. Yeah. Um, mm. I want to say that we, it's... I'm pretty... I, I mean... We're just assuming it's been confirmed because the way we says it, you know, for all we know, for all we know, there could be someone else, but I don't know. I don't know about that. I, I feel like this episode's confirmed that Jiren is the 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 mortal that's stronger than the god destruction. Oh, like no, how you we said. Confer- yeah. We clearly confirmed, like he literally stated that Jiren okay. is, is above a god of destruction at this point. Yeah, yeah. That's what he basically stated. Okay, okay, okay. Unknown, unknown human or hype guy. What's up, man? Welcome back to the stream. Um, but the question is, is he above? I don't think when I don't when think he's above an that, angel. It don't. It doesn't mean that he's a. I don't think it technically means he's above every god of destruction. Though. Okay. It may not mean every god of destruction. Yeah. Because that's that's the thing that's 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 the question now. Yes, Jiren is confirmed to be the one who has surpassed the God of Destruction. Mm-hmm. But it, what if it's just the, his God of Destruction? Okay, true. And then, again, we don't know who <clears throat> is the strongest out of the uh, 12 God of Destructions. We don't even know that either. Uh, well, for, see, the, um, the manga actually makes it look like Varys might be one of the strongest. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. he fought all of them hmm. in that one episode in the manga. I was, like, was going to bring back the whole Varys in the manga thing later once we get to the Ultra Instinct. Because oh, okay. Yeah, My bad. Yeah. Uh, it's cool. It's cool. Uh, but yeah, there is something. There's something that um that 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 when I saw the episode made me think of the manga right off the bat. That's why. Anyways, um, okay. The whole Genki Dama thing. Um, the whole back oh, and forth. Genki uh, Dama. The whole back and forth <laughs> thing. Whew. Like the fact that the pressures. I, poor Genki. Poor Genki Dama. What what did the Genki Dama like? Where do I go? You know, I'm getting forced between these two huge pressures. Where do I go? You know what? Let me just explode and everything. It just sucks that you know Goku um was much. I, I'm pretty sure he was much closer to the blast. So that's what happened. But oh man, um 
Cause like the when I saw the episode, I I didn't see I didn't see one part and then another part. The I didn't I I watched it illegally, you know, cause I didn't want to wait for you know a uh, Funimation, cause it crashed so many times. I'm like screw this, I I want to see it now, you know. Oh so, okay. So I waited I, for Crunchyroll. No, <laughs> I, I waited for the where I watch it. Uh, all it's it's all in uh, 1080p, you know, all HD and <laughs> stuff like that. But luckily for my the website that I used. It actually gave me uh, both episodes, you know, as one. So I got a full 42 minute of an episode. Okay. I didn't get, uh, you know, 24 minutes and another 24 minutes. So I didn't, I didn't get that break of, you know, oh, uh, of this. And then we come back and start with the free, uh, flashback. Uh, I got the full 42 minutes and stuff like that. All nicely, well, well done and everything. But what's it called? So I didn't know where, what episode was ended because uh, I, was, I, was, I was actually online on FIFA with Sage and Isai um, um, playing, and we were on the on the party list, so we were talking, we were watching it pretty much, you know, and I was like a minute ahead of them, um, and you know, he, they watched it episode by episode, so they mm-hmm. had a break, and I, and, I, and I continued hyping stuff up, and I'm like, wait, 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 it's over, what are you talking about, what are you talking about, I'm like, oh, mine is full, mine is the full 42 minutes, I don't have a break, you know, but, mm-hmm. um, What's it called? The whole the whole um thing when that happened, I was, I was my the goosebumps that I have I'm having right now just by talking about the whole Genki Dama back and forth. Just thinking about exactly, it. Exactly, huh? just thinking and talking about the whole back and forth stuff like that. Um, it was just gorgeous. The 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 animation once he once it explodes and you see Goku's face struggling trying to see if he can hold the power and stuff like that, and you see his eyes just go blank. It might have been due to the fact of the 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 color scheme, but I I when I saw that I'm like oh because that's I, that's how it ends for 109 right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cause um yeah cause when I was with Isai he was like oh this is how it ends I'm like what are you talking about you know so I was a little confused I didn't like I said I didn't know where it ended so I was I was confused but now it makes sense why uh when he he was surprised and he cause that's how it ends I'm like oh this is how it ends but yeah um that. Honestly, that would have been a that would have sucked if I was watching the episode episode because I'm like, damn it, now I gotta wait for advertisements to see the next episode because I wanted to see it now, you know, like fully now. Um, I don't human. You are they didn't even have advertisements. Oh really? Nice. When the episode actually came up, there were no uh breaks for me even when I watched it at least, and I didn't nice. I didn't have I didn't you I don't have premium? premium. Nice. So it just didn't like sometimes it would do that. Where it's just no advertisements, especially when it's something this big. That's what it would do it. Yeah. Crunchyroll had cut out almost a minute during the spare bomb struggle before it blew up in Goku's face. Oh, is that what happened, Ryan? I wouldn't know. I didn't watch it through Crunchyroll. But Ryan, welcome back to another stream. How's your day going so far, by the way? Um, you were saying? <laughs> My bad. Somebody said Crunchyroll cut it out. Yes, apparently Crunchyroll had cut out almost a minute during the spare bomb struggle. Before it blew up in Goku's face, um, I wouldn't know because I didn't watch through Crunchyroll. Uh, can you confirm that or, or what? Or what happened? Or what is he talking about? I mean, I would have to watch it somewhere else and see. Because from what I seen, I just saw it like I saw everything. Mm, okay. All right. I would have to watch Crunchyroll because I've already seen it from another sort. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you can do that and yeah. then confirm. Yeah. All right. Um, but for me, nothing was cut out. Okay. Oh, crap. There you go. Uh, what, what was it? Uh, yeah. Um, and then that's the episode 109. Holy crap! An hour in. That's for one uh, one episode. <sighs> Jesus Christ! Finally, we do the first can, episode. Finally, we can start with the the big the big stuff now. Holy crap! So 1010, because I'm gonna since 109 ends with the whole blast. So the way 1010 starts, pretty much. Again, I can't say because mine was full 42 minutes, so I didn't know when it cut it. Cause I didn't even I didn't even bother paying attention. Oh, we're at the we're at the 24 minutes, you know, and stuff. I was just I was just locked on watching the damn show. I didn't even realize how many minutes we were in, pretty much. But so 1010 starts <laughs> off with how how does 1010 start off officially then? Since you saw you saw it in both episodes separate, since I only saw full one, um, all one. Um, my perspective, I'm gonna assume it starts off with 1010 with the whole, um. Uh, what's it called? Beerus saying, you know, Son Goku, 
Is this uh, is this it? Blah blah blah. Or you you or the the whole. Uh, oh, he got he got uh vaporized and stuff like that with Whis and Bears talking and stuff like that. Oh, talking about the whole that freaking Champa out of nowhere. He's like, oh hey, Jiren gets eliminated because he killed you know Goku. And that's, that is so oh, fitting for Champa. I know to be the one who says exactly. That. He will be the one who sees somebody and be like, okay, he gotta go. Yeah, yeah he's like, oh, he gets disqualified. Oh man, and then and then freaking Vados uh, well, not necessarily Champa Sama, you know. Cause it was his own attack, you know. He pretty yeah. much destroyed himself, and the Grand Prix is pretty much confirmed. So yeah, it doesn't matter what happened. The fact that it's basically yeah, self destruction. Yeah, self destruction. Oh man. But I, I love the fact that it was Ch- you know, out of crazy. all of them, it had to be Champa. Like yeah, it fit. It it's, fit. It's, it's crazy how mu- it seemed like Barris. I love how. M- much bear seemed to be more affected by Goku possibly oh, being real. obliterated compared exactly. to everyone. Exactly, compared like, to Master Roshi, Krill, and all that, yeah. As Beerus. Exactly, everyone was that's just shocked. It's beautiful to see because it just shows you how much over this time span Beerus has grown to actually care for Goku. Yeah, it really did. I wait, Even though, like I say, <laughs> thanks to the spoilers, we knew what was going to happen, so it didn't affect me as much. You know, but when I heard Beerus, you know, be like, Son Goku, is this, is this really it? Are you done? And I'm, and I'm like, oh, okay. Now that got me, that actually gave me goosebumps as we speak right now. Because, like, we hardly see Beerus, you know, being um, sentimental and with anything, you know. It's just the way he's been. So, like how you said, it, it, it really did show how, how, um, words can't come out. It really shows how effect uh effective what the heck. Um Maybe maybe they fixed that before I actually started watching the episode, Ryan. But I'm I'm actually I'm gonna watch the episode a couple of more times after we talk about this. Anyway. Oh yeah, me too. So, I have to. So I'll see if it's like that on Country Roll still where it's, it's taking out the other stuff. Okay. Good and they had to cut but out yeah. it wasn't anything important. Okay, so what they had cut out wasn't anything important. All it was just unnecessary shots of Vegeta in the game gasping at the explosion. Oh, okay. So you got... I mean, that's good. It's channeled because Universe 6 is best universe... Oh, okay. I have a Twitter link that shows what they cut. Oh, okay, nice, nice. Um, I hate gasping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, I'm just telling for another minute. So Don't they do a lot of that in our Twitter? Just saying. Do they? <clears throat> do they really? <laughs> Oh man! <laughs> but no, um, and then that I think that's when, when you know, obviously, uh, I want to say his name, but I don't want to butcher his damn name. Who? Universe Eleven Scar Destructions. Oh okay. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, then the whole like you know he's like oh, I was a little worried back then <clears throat> with the whole spirit bomb, um, and stuff like that. But yeah, um, what's it called? I think that's when everyone started ganging up on him. You know, they're like, oh, this is not when they that's thought. A, that's another thing we have to say something about. He okay. had so much confidence and cockiness in Jiren. Yeah. But the fact that he was even unsettled for a little bit. And that was with the Genki Dama, because, you know, it's Genki Dama. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. No, that was the only moment when he was a little bit worried. And then he's like, you know, his cockiness and attitude came back. And be like, oh, that's right. I had no, I knew he was able to get that. Uh, I knew he was. I knew he had it in him, you know, like all that. I'm like, no, you were worrying. Come on, man. Oh uh, man, gasping for air or gasping because the anime is that good. Sure, wonder what help with one stone. How my dad walked in when I was watching and told me to start from the beginning. He doesn't like anime. Like he was hyped for this fight. Hell yeah, who wouldn't? It's the fight, you know. It's the fight in the animated. Uh, community <laughs> it's not even the, it's just the appetizer exactly we fight. all know there's a round we two. know it's going there's to gonna be again. exactly so th- if you thought this was the fight the next one i'm pretty sure i feel like the next time they fight though it's not gonna be i mean it's still gonna be epic but it's not gonna be as long as this one now you know in my opinion but who knows <clears throat> i'm talking about gasping in general Devin, not just in dbs and naruto <laughs> oh man alright and then I, yeah I was saying like that's the moment when I think everyone was trying to gang, gang up on them right I think 
I think it was like right after that. Your stone broke, not real broke. Oh man, I know. Damn. God damn. Mm. Alex, Alex is being savage over here. Oh man. Okay, can I get the twenty minutes out? Yay! Twenty minutes. I've been literally, we've been literally, I've been literally haven't been playing Dokkan at all. I was just waiting. For hey, I noticed you just been on the final screen. I haven't even been playing. Like I've been just talking. Oh Especially no, me too. At the chat the whole time. No, I, it's just that I had. I was in the final, but I had 17 salmon. I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna leave it here for 15 minutes. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's not the fight. It's next episode. Oh, we'll talk about the next week's episode. <laughs> we not yeah. there yet. We're not. There I'm yet. sorry. Goku versus Jiren is more hype than. Uh, I'm just gonna throw that out there. I'm sorry. I know. <laughs> I, don't, I mean, a, I don't think his, it's still a filler. Awesome, I don't I'm think sorry. it's a filler episode next. I don't think it should be considered as a filler. You know, it's still hit, you know. Um, but yeah, it's just after we got to see Jiren with Goku, it's like, what can he do? Let's you know? talk about some other fight True. that's that's in the spoilers that I know about. Oh, I have not been. I haven't kept up with the spoilers in this in this next upcoming ones. So. Oh yeah, yeah, it's like in the future a little bit. Yeah. Well, it was yeah. kind of around the same time hitting Jiren. Yeah, but... oh, okay. It, okay, back to the, yeah. the back, back to the back to the episode one hundred ten. <laughs> uh, go we, ahead. We're at basically the part where everyone's ganging around. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, some people looked at that and it was like, um, everyone was ganging around, basically looking mm -hmm. at the hole. Oh, but they, it was it's it's clear it's clear to me. Universe that everybody 4. Everybody was come. Everyone was ganging around. Yeah, especially to basically fight. Yeah, Universe the, Four the started off. Yeah, Universe Four started off. I think that was. I think they were the first ones that you see because we see the Supreme Kai and the God Destruction of their universe first after what happens, and then we see the Universe Four um, last um, um, fighters um, going. Then we just started slowly seeing every everyone else's other universe. Besides, and then I we think, saw Kabe, and then Hit came. Yeah. Uh, oh man! When Hit comes in, Jiren's response, assassins, what was it? Hits from uh, Universe 60 assassin or something. What do you want? You know, it's like damn. Like not even, not even saying, like not not even like being phased from. It's just like, what do you want? You know, you're nothing. I I took it as in like, Jiren's to the point where it was like, you're nothing to me, Hit. You know, you're not worth my time. So what do you want? You know. Um, so that's how you looked at it. Yeah, that's how I looked <laughs> at it. Dang. And I, and it sucks because I love hits the character, you know? It's like but oh man, next week he's gonna get so bodied. Oh fuck. I looked at, at it more so oh so you really wanna go now. <laughs> oh no, I took it. Way. You, I, I looked at it as uh, cause I don't think he remember this is Jaren we talking about, someone who respects everybody. Like he well True. not I'm not gonna say respects everybody, but he doesn't underestimate anybody. Yeah. And he's seen hit fight before. Yeah. So I'm I'm pretty sure his thought process is like what I'm surprised you coming at me now out of all times. Okay. Like you really like is this what you really want? Like <laughs> you see what I just did. Is this uh, what you really want? And that wasn't even his full extent. Like that's even the best part. That wasn't even his full extent. Like holy crap. And the difference between Jaren and Hit, even though Jaren has watched Hit fight before, where Jaren has seen what Hit can do and his the flaws and Hit's technique. Yeah. And what he can do to overcome that. Yeah. Hit hit looked at basically someone who has who's flawless when it comes to fighting. Like Jiren had no opening in that entire fight. Even even um was it Bottles, I think? Well who what was which one was it? Bottles was it? There's that yeah, usually when people um usually when people um had a big win a, fight and after and they, they beat win it, a victory, they win a victory, yeah. they they lower the guard. You know, that's usually their weakness. But no, Jiren doesn't have that weakness. I was like, God damn. Yeah, you, you realize you skipped the, the fight, right? <laughs> yeah. But I, I, because you brought up the whole thing. That's why I just went off of that. Oh, okay. Okay, now let's, let's revert <laughs> yeah. back. Now let's go back. Win. Yeah. <laughs> I just grabbed the Twitter link. Where can I post? Uh, if you want to post it on, through Discord, that will be better. Because Nightbot will time you out for five seconds if you post it on here. So post it on um through Discord. Uh, in thirty, I think Nightbot will delete the link. 
Yeah, mm-hmm. Nightbot will delete the link and will probably time you out for five seconds. Um, so yeah, if you want, just put it on Discord. You know, um, put it in um, uh, announcements. Yeah. Like you were saying. Oh, what were you gonna say? Okay, so now we're basically at the earthquake. Or the quote-unquote earthquake oh. that happens in Dragon that We all know what that means. Yeah, when, yeah, when there's a... yeah. Okay, so then the interesting part about this was to me, when when Jaren first powered up, uh-huh. everyone was basically like, he's shaking the entire void. Oh, okay, okay. So the same time, so that happened. So it was, it was, it was interesting to hear it again when Goku did it. Yeah. So it was like, okay, so you know, this form basically caught Goku up. Oh heck yeah! I mean, it had to, you know, like before purpose, even the fight to. started. But yeah. you knew, yeah. you knew once you heard that that it caught him up. Yeah. Because they used the same exact phrase they used for Jerry. Mm-hmm. Oh man, but. And to see Weiss, to see Beerus's face, and Weiss is like, "Do you have anything to say, Lord Beerus?" And Beerus gathers his composure. Oh, he's like, oh, no, that that was when he's he said, coming. I'm yeah. like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, oh man. And even Krillin says, so, "Oh, no, no doubt about it. It's Goku." You know, I'm like, Krillin, not even. You were like, you were saying he was done, and now you're pulling it off. Like, oh no, no, no. I, I, I knew he was okay. Like, well, Krillin was more like, "There's no way." Like, yeah, he was more like that. But Frieza was like, I'm not surprised. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> was like, man, no surprise this there. episode, I just love Frieza because of the way he acts. It's like, yep, exactly. yep, that's my rival, you know? That's it's that's. Like, it's nice to see Frieza in this light yeah. compared to how he was in the, the, the whole Namek saga. <laughs> True. Oh, man. But no, oh, when he comes, that epic, epicness, epicness, Jesus, words these days. I can't speak right. Um, he comes out, and then we see the the from what the what got leaked out the little uh, animated trailer tre- uh, preview yeah. that we got. That that's the part that we see. I'm like, oh shit, here it is. Oof, and it and that that score for him. Was yes, beautiful. exactly. I was gonna say this. Like, damn, the music and everything was just so epic. I literally have goosebumps. Like, it was nice Holy that they crap. didn't necessarily. Jiren had his own thing. Yeah, they they had a new score for Goku's form, like. They didn't just recycle the whole god form that we normally hear. Yeah. Like the fact that they added so much in the just one episode, or basically two, but really, in terms of like one ten, is a bigger, like that that started a whole different kind of fight compared to one oh nine. So oh yeah, we focus on one ten when it comes yeah. to the scores right now. Oh yeah. No, Beerus said that because he or nobody couldn't feel his key. Uh, what do you mean, Kalifa? Yeah, what you talk about, homie? Check friend list, sure. You wanna, you wanna try me? I don't think you wanna try me. Oh, you got knocked down. <laughs> you're, you're already at eight fifty seven. You were at eight thirteen last time. Well, I'm not playing. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> I can easily gain that back. I'm playing on times third, and I'm oh, on. A, I'm, I'm past my. I'm past my twenty streak. Oh, lucky. I haven't. I haven't been playing that much. I'm barely back on my ten. <laughs> Did you ever hit to a twenty win streak? No, I died at at twelve I, I, or eleven. Listen, I died so much. Oh, like man. the first day when when we was in your stream. Yeah, I I literally died. I don't at nineteen. Uh, you were at nineteen win streak and you died. That's what, I remember you coming in here like, oh, I just died right on my nineteenth win streak. I died to Rose. Damn. No, hitting me with a normal attack. For how much? Like one hundred and something k. Oh damn, that that did more than what SJ Four Goku did. But then again, I had a I I had a reduction. Um, <laughs> no, he did one hundred k on a normal attack against yeah, Vegeta. SJ Four Goku did me hit me for eighty four eighty four or eighty six uh, k with a reduction. I was like, holy crap! But uh, but this is Super, Super Saiyan Four Vegeta is supposed to be able to tank. Yeah, you're not supposed to get hit with a yeah. normal attack against from Rose. For 100k, that's crazy. Yeah. Yes, I know, White Lightning, you're ahead of me. Not by that much. <laughs> All right, post it. Nice. Does anyone see that? Yes, I'm at 80 streak. Of course, you are, Kali. All right. 
But no, the the score was beautiful when it came down. When he came back up, I was like, holy crap, man. That that the moment that happened, I was like, oh, the goosebumps came, and I was just like, even more hyped. Mm. I was like, yes, yes, the real fight's about to start at least for now, you know, until we get round two. Um. But oh man, hey Zane, guess what? I just got on the step five on the Naruto CM2 Sasuke's banner. Uh, I don't know, Sasuke. Uh, I knew I was surpassed you, of course, white lady. Of course, I believed in you too, man. Oh man. Oh. Uh, and then, and then, oh, you were gonna say something? No, I'm listening to you. Oh, okay. I know, cause I, right when I said something, I heard your voice. I thought you were gonna say something. Or maybe you're just gasping for it, or I don't know. <laughs> oh no, my allergy is starting to kick in, oh, so it's almost okay. time to wrap this up. All right. <laughs> uh, well, we're pretty much there. We're almost. <laughs> oh, and then he comes back in. The 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 timing. I looked away. No, I think I blinked. No, I think I blinked, and I missed him from where he starts, and he was already in. With the, going for a kick, and I see Jiren dodge. I'm like, wait, wait, wait. I got. I need to go back because I missed yeah. it. I literally it missed quick. it. Exactly. I missed it. I'm like, oh, I gotta go back. Ten seconds. I'm like, oh, okay. You know what? It looked like. Have you? You've seen the Matrix, right? No. Oh wow. I am disappointed in you. No. I just no. Okay, you were gonna say though. No, about... there's no point of bringing it up. No, no, but bring it, it up. almost looked People... like his vision was like was kind of blurred because of all of the heat oh. coming from his body. Oh, okay. Because when you, if you notice, like, you can see him kind of look like he couldn't really see clearly mm-hmm. when Goku first came back. Yeah. Oh, Did okay. you notice that when he was trying, when he was trying to key in on Jiren and uh, the, the Pride Troopers? Probably not, honestly. I it was a- before he took his step and he looked at them. Oh, okay, no, because I think that, I'm telling you, I missed it. I went back, I went back okay. just to see the the step he took and going towards the attack. I probably didn't see that part. I, I'm going to watch it anyways after this, anyways. Yeah, yeah you'll know <laughs> what I'm talking about once yeah. you see it. Right, you still here? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Devin's you... best quote is, no, I'm listening to you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, because I, I, I thought you left because you were talking and then it just went quiet for like that brief moment. I was like, okay, <laughs> Um, no, but oh man, that that form, and then when Jiren starts going to attack, and then the whole the the instincts just kicks in, and just he's just swaying Yo, back. Yo, go, go as as bad as as Jiren was in that episode. Goku in this form that's not even one hundred percent mastered oh my god. yet. Oh my god, his movement alone, dude. This was, was the best thing I've ever seen. Was I'm it, sorry. Was it just me? I mean, obviously, you like the, the this form, his form right now. I love this form more to the point where I, I liked it because it felt malicious. It felt, you know, like like if he was a bad guy, if Goku was a bad guy, this is how he would act, you know? Because the whole him being quiet, being silent... You know, it were, it's basically reminiscent. All of this episode was basically reminiscent of when Goku first went Super Saiyan. Basically. Yeah, but it was it's more ever because of the new form and everything. And then yeah, like, and exactly. then oh my god, though, like, oh, what the hell? Like seeing Goku not like you could tell he's, but at the same time, at, at, you could tell he he's at the same time not himself at that point. Yeah, like you could yeah. tell he had no. I don't even think he had his own. I don't. Um, I don't want to say. I don't, I don't you're, know how you're to breaking say up. You're you break. You're breaking up like a, a tad bit. Like you, you come in and you come and go. Like just for like a yeah, brief moment. You doing that to me too? Sometimes. Oh, okay. okay. Is it better now? Ah uh, yeah. Or... Chibi Jen, get lost. What are you talking about? Welcome to the stream, by the way. Did Khalifa change the title? No. Okay. <laughs> what I like is that he surprised all the gods. Yeah. Oh, and then oh. the best part the month, for me is that the moment Beerus mentioned Ultra what Instinct? was possibly yeah. doing, yeah. everybody was like, oh, hell no. No, no, no. The best part for me was before that, when we, out of nowhere, got <laughs> super excited. I was like... Oh, yeah. I was, that, that's, that's like, that's my student right yes, there. Yes, exactly. Like, that's the pride like of that. Boy. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I, I was like... And then when, when freaking... um. 
when when he was when he got super excited, I don't. It got me excited even more too. It was like, okay, what's the name? What's the name? What are you guys gonna call it? What is his form? And then, and then what's like, uh, Beerus is the Ultra Instinct and stuff like that. But before that though, if you this is pretty much what um, Whis has been training Goku and Vegeta since the beginning. If you've noticed, like this is what they've been what this is what he's been trying to teach them like to to master to get to this point, this instinct. Which this is the part where I'm gonna bring up the manga. Cause you know how in the manga where we it makes it seem like Beerus is the strongest god of destruction, in the manga all he does is instinctively just dodges it. You know, like it doesn't. I'm not saying that he ha in the manga he has Ultra Instinct. Is I feel like he just has a higher instinct compared to everyone else because he I I can't remember who who I can't remember who quoted but saying something like, oh yeah he's just he's just he's just uh, dodging instinctly. You know he's not he's not even trying anything. It's just all instinct for Beerus. Pretty much, I can't remember who said that. I um, but and then I'm like, oh, I took that into account. Like, oh, is it, it, it could could we, I want? I can't wait to see this part in the manga to see um how Beerus is gonna react because it makes it seem like at least with Beerus in the manga, you know, he he. I'm not saying he has Ultra Instinct in it. Well, I but think he it, has it's, a it's, high it's level. It's been stated that. They haven't. He hasn't mastered it. Oh well, yeah, like he... and, but but keep in mind the anime and manga is like they're taking different routes, but they're following in the end. And they're going in yeah. the same story mode. I mean the same story. It's gonna conclude the same thing. It's just they're taking different routes. For all we know, you know, um, Ultra Instinct is like the only person that has it. It could be Beerus in the manga and stuff like that. But I don't know. That's 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 totally something else. But yeah, but yeah. we know it's been teased since Resurrection. Yeah, now. yeah pretty much. And and. You you say you wouldn't call their form as technique, mm -hmm. but when something changes your entire appearance, mm -hmm. it's te it's te it's it's not like a whole transformation, but it is a new form. Because it would just be a technique if he could do it still in just regular base form or in God. Yeah, uh, you're you're responding it's to Ryan, right? Blue. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, I was reading that too. The moment you started speaking, I read that. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I consider it more of a form than just a technique. Cause yeah. it, just because, at least for Goku. Didn't Opa Senpai say that about the manga with Beerus? I haven't, I haven't keep, I haven't kept, eh, I haven't been keeping up with Opa Senpai. I think the last video that I saw of him was like the new form when we got leaked. Beerus in the manga is the strongest god of destruction. True, but we don't know. We're assuming, you know, it hasn't been really confirmed. But we're just assuming. We're all just speculating if that's the case. Just the way it makes it seem like it. Um, but yeah, the moment we got excited, I was excited. Just because, like, yes, like how you said, that's my student. <laughs> that's my student. Yes, my student. He finally mastered it. Oh, and then when he tells Beerus, so anything you have to say. And he's like, ultra instinct. That's what it is. And then, oh, Champa's ears when he says that. Like how you said, all the God Destructions hear that. And they're <clears> like... Even though some of them, they don't act like, oh shit, you know, but you see the sweat, you know, the little, the little yeah, sweat like, on like them. Yeah, like some people, some people you expect to have more composure, for example, yeah. um, Ging, Ging. Yeah, that's the universe Which is 12, that, right? the amphibian, the amphibian looking dude. Oh, okay. Who's not participating, his, yeah. his universe isn't in that's, the tournament. That's, um... Like, he was just standing there with his arms crossed, but you can see, like, the little sweat droplet on top of his temple. Yeah, yeah. Whereas Chopper... You know he's gonna have a dramatic <laughs> yeah, response. Yeah, he to knew that. he was. I mean, it's Champa. He had to. And then you expect the clown to have that to respond where he's holding his hair. He's like, hell. Yeah. Huh? Oh, like you man. expect that from them because exactly. he's already been. Yeah. He's been talking during up basically. Yeah, exactly. Thing, and plus, uh, yeah, exactly. To so the fact it's it's the fact that he says, oh no way. He how how the fact that no, not just that the fact that who who's the one that says that, that who's the one that says that, that not even gods. Can master that it's it's difficult even for gods. Who's the one that says it? Was it Beerus? Uh, Supreme Kai. Oh, Supreme. Oh, okay. Wait, really? Which one? I believe it was a Supreme. I I don't know. I can't remember. I I think it was. Um, I think it's eleven. I, I think it was yeah the same yeah, Supreme yeah. Kai. I think it had to be eleven. Oh man. But because one thing about him, he hasn't to me this entire time. He hasn't underestimated Goku at all either. Mm -hmm. Like he's been praising Goku the entire time. Yeah. When you really look at it, that's true. That's why he's like, yeah. If Jiren can beat down Goku, you know, that's no. Everyone else should probably like lose like hope and try to go after Jiren because of that. If we can, if we can knock out the, 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 
there we go. The 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 strongest the second strongest one, you know, it makes sense. But oh man. When we right when they start fighting and then Topo and Dispo comes in trying to help in. I, when 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 that happened, I was like, "Come on, you guys are the pride troopers. You're trying to gang up on someone. Come on, where's your pride and stuff like that?" You know, well, that's but, teamwork. Yeah, exactly, teamwork. exactly. And then I'm like, "Oh well." Then again, they, 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 they exactly what you said. Oh, it's teamwork. But still, I was like, "Come on, have have some respect to your your to freaking Jiren." You know, like, are you really saying uh, that like, "Oh, now he's a threat"? I mean, even though he he was for a bit, but just. Just where to the point where we found out that oh, Jiren still has some reserves in him um, after everything that happened. Oh, and the best part for me that I liked once he <laughs> once we finally hear sound off of Goku, you hear a roar. You know, like if he had some demon in him, or or it just reminded me of like the Great Ape, you know, and stuff like that. Oh man. Yeah. Who's everyone's favorite angel? Mine is the Harley Quinn looking one. Anything Harley Quinn look like, I'm going to choose that. I'm a huge Harley Quinn fan, so yeah. And this was, before everyone tells me, I just, I just, I just hype on the train. Conf I'm confused as whether or not Kalisa is correcting me or agreeing with me. <laughs> no, didn't the Supreme Kai of Universe 1 said that? I think. She said Universe 1? I think. He's, I think she's uh, agreeing that it was a Supreme Kai, but disagreeing oh, okay, that it wasn't Universe 11. It was Universe 1. I think oh. that's what she's trying to say. Well, I just said it was a Supreme Kai, and I just said, I don't know. No, because I, was... I said 11, and then you're like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah I think so, yeah. But, yeah. Um, um, my favorite is Whis, just saying that. Yeah, that will uh, forever yeah, be yeah. my favorite. I, I know it's Whis. You, you, you always tell me. Mine is the Harley Quinn one, just because, like I said, I'm a huge fan of Harley Quinn. But this, I was a huge Harley Quinn fan when she was when she first appeared in the animated series of Batman. Back then, you know, from the old Batman. The, 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 the one that I think is the true Batman series, not the new ones and crabby-ass ones. Besides, like, um, Batman Beyond, I like that one too, but still. Uh, anyway, that's totally off topic. Back, back to... Um, the show. You were gonna say something, or or what, Devin? Or, or, or were you saying something? What were we on? Because we got because because I was talking about the chat for a second. Uh, we were talking. We were talking about, about the roar. The roar, basically. Yeah, I I, I, I was talking about the roar, which reminded me of the great ape and stuff like that. All I gotta say is, at that point, Goku hit guy. He hit Jared. Oh yeah. The, like, I don't he, know where that knee. I think it was a knee. I'm pretty yeah, sure it, was it, first, it was two knees yeah. at first, and then it was that blast. I don't, yeah. I don't want to say it was. I can't tell. I couldn't tell if it was a Kamehameha or just a regular. I thought it was, key just, a, blast. I thought it was just a regular key blast. But it was the way it happened was yeah. just beautiful. Yeah. Oh. And okay, about the spoilers, the reason I said they were wrong, they they misled you. Okay. Because the spoilers made it really seem that like because the spoilers was basically like oh Goku gets a new form transforms. Oh, and okay. it's still it's still not enough. Yeah, yeah. But basically, what happened in the actual show, the anime, just what we have seen in the episode, mm -hmm. is the moment Goku was it was just like it was it was reminiscent of when Vegito Blue went in for the final punch. Yeah. Against Zamas. Okay. And how he he was going in for that final punch, mm -hmm. and then at the same, but he basically defused at that point. Yeah, yeah. yeah. At that moment, Goku ran out of the energy. Yeah. So it's not like Jiren didn't actually technically beat Goku's new form. Yeah, but it's not like just the that. spoilers basically indicate. Oh, okay, okay, I get you now. Yeah. Um, but the thing with that was well, not 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 that part. Um, what I was gonna say is that the <clears> fact <throat> that J you know the big the big move that. Goku does, which I, I I thought of it as of a dragon fist, you know, like when he did with uh, King Piccolo when he did that move, um, uh, when he was uh, when he, in Dragon Ball, you know how he just goes in with just with this and that's it. I I thought of it of, I thought it was that kind of I thought it was the same move or something similar to it. I th I didn't think it was just a regular fist, um, since he. It's knew... more so. It's basically a god fist, like. Oh, there you go. That's there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. I only say Jack because was. I couldn't remember the other the other the other one names, but yeah, pretty much. And and the fact that Jiren like a badass stops it and be like, say it's interesting, but 
but this is your limit or something. I think that's what he says, right? This is this is uh this is the extent. Yeah, of your that's limit. what I was saying though. He yeah. didn't technically oh. stop. He didn't stop Goku's Goku's huge Goku's punch yeah. exactly. It, like, cause at that same time, Goku at that same moment, that's he stopped he, the yeah. punch. Goku lost that energy. Yeah. Yeah. He ran out of that energy. Exactly. Like he was back in base form at that point. <sighs> and then that's when your boy hit came in after he blasted Goku. Oh, for real. Okay. <laughs> okay. Question for you: When Goku teleports, did he? Was it? Him that did instant transformation, or was or did Frieza took him? Cause like uh, the I, I think it was I, I think it was Goku. I thought it was instant transformation, but then I'm like, it he just instant transmitted to the point where Frieza was just in there, you know, like totally there, you know. Um, I I thought of it like I, I thought maybe Frieza, um, you know, sneak behind Vegeta somehow was fast enough to just take him and poof, you know. But yeah, I don't think I don't think he's that fast for Vegeta not to notice. True, but uh, that's that's what I thought in the beginning. But I'm like, I'm gonna assume it's instant transmission because that's the only way, you know, like what how. Yeah, go- how's- I'm pretty sure Goku knew at this point he needed to rest. Yeah. Oh yeah, he knew. Yeah, he's he's not he's not like, oh, let me get back in it. No, no, he he's smart. You know, Goku is a brilliant when it comes down to fighting. You know, he adapts very well, just like with the whole, just like the main characters, pretty much of every any shonen types. Uh, it was Goku. Okay, I think Frieza swooped in. Okay, so Ryan is on the same boat with me. I thought so too. I'm gonna assume I, I just because I love Frieza so much. Frieza is literally my favorite villain in Dragon Ball Z. I mean, we'll see in the next yeah, episode. That's but true. I, I really think that's it was, true. I don't think he would have moved that fast though. Yeah. Uh, I love to the point where Vegeta was like, "What was that, Kakarot? Tell me." I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, he wanted to cause, know. Because you know, you know, Vegeta. I, yeah. I, you did that. I want to do that next. Oh man! At the same time, it did sound like instant transmission. So exactly, that's what like the noise made it seem like instant transmission. That's what uh, that's what I initially thought. But I I wanted to give Frieza. I'm like, oh, maybe it was Frieza. <laughs> uh, but what's it called? Uh, we're pretty and then much. It looked like more. It more so looked like if that was the case, it would. I think it would have looked more like Frieza was already standing there, but it looked like Frieza kind of walked up a little bit. I need to re-see that the last part pretty much. I need to see that. I need I, I need to rewatch this plenty of times again. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm gonna watch it a million times because it's so yeah. it's it's no way you cannot watch this. Yeah. More than one time, like I know you can. It was, it was that really beautifully, can. especially I... for Dragon Ball in particular when it comes to animation. Yes. Dragon Ball is so legendary mm-hmm. that you don't really have to. It doesn't really. It's one of those animes that can get get away. And yeah. still be with the with the, their animation being lazy, and it still will get be so popular. Yeah. So the fact that they put so much into this and into the animation, and it looked better than anything in Dragon Ball history, just was like wow. <laughs> oh man! But and it, it cut, we're pretty much at the end. So, what do you think? What do you think, Frieza? With Frieza. And how it ended. I, I have what my... Do I think, what do I think Freeze is going to do? Yeah, what is he going to do? Uh, Fr- Freeze mentioned that this brought back memories of Nami. Exactly. That's exactly... So we're on so the same the only, boat. The only so we're thing on the same boat. Is Goku gave Freeze energy. Exactly. And Freeze is going to do the same thing. So exactly. I think Freeze is going to basically yeah. do the same exactly. thing. Just That's to ex- repay him exactly. for that. The, exactly. The moment, he's, the moment Freeze is like, oh, this brings me back some bad memories. The whole Genki Dama and all that. And then the way it mm-hmm. ends, I'm like, oh, so you're going to give him uh, some of your energy. Nice. Which is, makes sense because I'm pretty sure Freeza does not want to... Because he still owes Goku because of that, you know? And even though... Well, technically, Freeze don't owe him yeah. nothing, but <laughs> I, but he, Frieza's, you know, like, oh, you gave me energy, you know, but like, like, it's 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 like the character of Frieza. He doesn't want to owe anyone, even if anything, you know. So I yeah, feel my like... thing basically is Frieza's not stupid. Like, yeah, yeah. if he was gonna betray them, he would have done it right now. Gohan. Yeah, he like, that time before Gohan, he would have sided with Frost at that point instead yeah. of uh, yeah. giving Frost the runaround. Yeah. And, and especially at this point, now that he knows that Jiren exists, mm-hmm. he knows he's, he's going to need Goku. Yep, yep. A lot of people kept saying that the end somehow was going to be, you know, Goku and Gohan 
and then potentially Gohan might be the one that, you know, saves Universe 7. After this, I'm like, I have no idea how Gohan is going to shine now, you know. What about you? Do you still believe Gohan somehow is going to shine in this? As in, like, he's going to be the reason why Universe 7 lives. Or do you still think it's going to be Goku and Gohan against um, Jiren? And then Gohan I mean, the only, and then the Gohan only way... The only way Gohan in that in that aspect would be able to save, be the savior for Universe Seven is is if it's is if um in the final minutes, like if what happens, what I'm thinking is going to happen, if as le- if at least one person from every universe is in the ring still, mm-hmm. that universe gets a pass and they get to stay. Yeah. If it, everyone in Universe is? Seven, if I don't know, they didn't they didn't say that. Oh, I thought that's they what it was. They never stated okay. that. No, they never stated it. Oh, okay. So if let's say. If everyone gets eliminated, and at the last final seconds, Gohan is the only one left, and he's about to get eliminated, mm-hmm. but time runs out before then. Yeah, that's the only that's the only way I think Gohan could save them. Oh, Especially okay. if Jiren if Jiren is still in the ring, that's the only way. Because okay. Gohan isn't, in my opinion, Gohan isn't stronger than Goku, Vegeta, or Frieza. Oh yeah, exactly. Uh, it just sucks because you know how it's, we can't. It's debatable keys. that he's even stronger than seventeen because I think they're either either seventeen in my I opinion feel, is I feel a, like little bit stronger, a little bit stronger, yeah. Or they're both on par with each other. I feel I, I, I love Gohan, but I think I want to give it to seventeen, just like a tad. Because seventeen showed us something that Gohan had. Gohan hasn't really shown much for yeah. real to me. Like his best moment when, was when, when he went ultimate when, against yeah. Frieza. Yeah. Um, and then that was even a real moment because exactly. he he knew what was up. Exactly, and Frieza didn't even go all all out too. So it's like exactly neither of them actually yeah. did. Yeah. Um, was it, I don't know like because there's still that tease that oh you know Gohan wants to get stronger, a new form, a different route than than obviously his dad. So it's like we all we were all hoping and expecting that we were going to see this new form coming out in this tournament but then it's like that would have to be like an ass pull from Toei some story wise you know just that it's just some bullshit ways like oh here's out of nowhere a huge power up that can just take down freaking Jiren or go par with him or something like that like I just hope that doesn't happen you know they don't just pull something out of the ass you know out of their ass and be like oh there you go for all the Gohan fans cause it's, I wouldn't like that oh man but no, this episode was freaking amazing. Now, I, I will say, I would love to see... I, w- I still want to see either Gohan versus Topo, Vegeta versus Topo, or Frieza versus Topo. I think I kind of want to see Frieza versus Topo more. Just so... Because you know how see, Topo with the I, whole pride Part of me trooper. wants to see that, but I, I feel like Gohan would be the best matchup for Topo. Yeah, yeah. As, especially, as, I really think Vegeta and Frieza... I don't know. I was, Jiren and Goku have have overshadowed everybody exactly. to the point so much. <laughs> where like I don't, I can't really tell where everyone's at power wise right now. Oh man, for like, real, it's with, clear. It's clear to me that those are the two top two. Oh dogs. hell yeah! With no yeah. like, people, Goku surpassed Hit when he beat him in the filler. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's why they made that filler episode because they knew. That Jiren was the next one for Goku. Yeah, exactly. They didn't have time for Goku and Hit in the tournament of power. Exactly. And then not just that either. The whole, like, I thought it was going to go. If anything, if we're going to choose, if we're choosing fights, obviously it's going to be Jiren and, and Goku, round two, obviously. Um, I kind of want at least Hit to go up against Vegeta, you know, so they can do the thing. Because Vegeta still owes Hit payback from what happened from back then. Um, and then I would love to see, like how you said, Gohan more suited for Topo, you know? So it's like father and son going up against the top two from the strongest universe, you know? Yeah, see, I can see that happening yeah. where Goku and Gohan versus Jiren and Topo, but I don't think it's going to be like a tag team. Oh, no, no. I think it would be more of one fight's happening in one area and the other fight's ha- happening in the other. Yeah. Does Gohan even Just have Goku? That- no. Just for the fact that I know Goku, like even though Topo and them, they they all about teamwork. But I know yeah. Jiren is at the point where he only like if he's gonna fight Goku, he wants that to be a one on one. One on one, yeah, yeah. Oh man, mm-hmm. this episode is too good. 
All right. I think um, Gohan did not go toe to toe with Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Oh no, no. He asked Gohan, Su- Goku in Super Saiyan Two was, was overwhelming. More, yeah, Ultimate, Ultimate Gohan. Gohan. Yeah. When he went, when he went, Kalkin Blue, he one shot Gohan, yeah. and Gohan just managed to instinctively throw one last punch, which, which missed, exactly. and before he passed out. Exactly. Gohan so he did not go to he did not go toe to toe with no Super Saiyan Blue Goku. I agree with that too, though. The Vegeta <clears throat> versus Hate rematch is gonna happen, going to happen. It was part of the episode leaks a while. Oh crap! Now, in in no way, shape, or form, though. Does that mean Gohan isn't strong? Like, I, Gohan's clear. I think Gohan's stronger Go, than what he's shown you now. You gotta remember, everyone, everyone keeps saying, uh, the Supreme Kai's and Vegeta himself said that, yeah, the the half-breeds are usually, have more potential than full-breed Saiyans. Gohan has tremendous potential. The point, the problem is, it just depends on the writers, you know? They, they can make Gohan surpass um, Goku, Story wise, because um, Toriyama wanted uh, in, in the cell arc, Toriyama wanted Gohan um, to surpass Goku, which he did, but he wanted Gohan to be the main character, that's why uh, Goku died. But a lot of people didn't like that, a lot of people thought it was too soon for Gohan. That's why you know, when the margin, um, um, the Majin Buu arc came back, um, Goku came back pretty much, you know, and Gohan, you know, just Gohan, just you know what. I'm sorry. As much as I love Gohan, Goku's a better main character. Exactly. And, and being the face of Dragon Ball than Gohan would ever Exactly. That, that's, what, that's what happened with Toriyama. Like, he wanted Gohan to be the face, but it didn't fit. And a lot of people thought it's way too soon. They'd rather have Goku. So that's why everything... I didn't even know you were better. doing a summon right now. Dang. I just see you pulled back. <laughs> Ain't even release it. Yeah. I just thought uh, Winner said, "Do the summon already, man. <laughs> I'll do it with you." Damn, you're doing a multi? Oh hell no! I'm not doing a multi. I'm just doing a single. Now we're gonna end it off with. Just... What you doing a single? Uh, the GSSR. Oh, yeah. I'm not touching mine yet. <laughs> yeah. uh, I'm only. I'm not even touching. I'm not even touching my world tournament tickets yet because I know I'm waiting for the new Jackie Chun in them to come out. Oh yeah, the world, the the Dragon Ball term. On the I, Dragon I still, Ball banner. Yeah, I have like forty seven gold tickets or forty one something like that. I, I, those are all safe. This is just the GSSRs. I I have ten left after this. Um, but yeah. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm done with Super. What about you? Are you content or do you want to continue? I can pull another hour. I don't know about you though. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You cut out through that oh. whole time. Uh, I was gonna say I'm content with the. The time that we've done with uh, talking about Super, are you or do you want to continue? I'm always down to continue. What's what is there more to say about Super exactly. at this point? Unless we talk, we done with the talk about the basically the two episodes. Yeah, all and, we can talk about now is what's going to happen next. Well, I'm pretty or what sure. We, or basically, not even what happens next because I know the spoilers, so I wouldn't talk about that. But okay, more so, what what would you like to see happen? in the tournament, in the remaining hours of the tournament, whether it's next or in the future. I feel okay. like there should be another Genki Dama, like I said, but this time with everyone that's in the tournament still, and they just, um, you know, with, um, but instead of him throwing it, he absorbs it so he can replicate the whole, uh, the form again, and then somehow he's going to surpass, I still feel like he's going to surpass that limit again, one more, because the fact that, you know, Jiren still has that reserve where he didn't bust that Aurora, the whole, uh, the red Aurora, um, towards the end. Pretty because, you know, Goku was about to push him, but he ran out, you know. So, what I want to see really is another Genki Dama, him absorbs it, takes the power, somehow does the form again, and even surpasses that. Which, I don't know how that's going to happen, honestly, in, like, in their real lifetime, because they only have 20 minutes left, you know. Um, and then the epic next epicness second round Toto against Jiren, we, which we all know there's gonna be a, another round. But I want Goku to surpass his limit even one more further, that can now fully challenge Jiren to his fa- um, max uh, capacity. At least that's what he, I want. What about? I you? don't want to see the Genki Dama again <laughs> and him absorb it for the simple fact that I don't. I want Goku to use the form naturally. 
Like without, I don't, I honestly don't think he actually used the fault, like the the whole uh, ultra instinct, technically because he just absorbed the energy. I think what happened was, like, I think it unlocked it, like it triggered it. I really think what happened was because he exhausted all of his energy mm-hmm. when he absorbed the energy from the spirit bomb. Yeah. That energy basically made his body move after that. Yeah. Like, Goku wasn't re- really instinctively doing anything himself. Like, his body was at that point. Yeah. Which is basically what Ultra Instinct is. It's for your body to move before you, your, your mind processes anything. So you don't have to think. Your body automatically moves on its own. Yeah. That's, that's why I think the whole point of the, absorbing that was the first time. Because he because for it to basically unlock and trigger that ability for Goku to unlock and tap that. Yeah. So I want to see him base, basically be able to do it without absorbing anything. Because I don't want it to be like another situation where it's like in GT, or basically they did it in GT and they did it in uh, Super, where Goku achieved uh, Super Saiyan God the first time uh-huh. by having that little Super Saiyan ritual. Yeah. I don't want... I don't. I don't want to keep saying. I want to, like. I want to see how it is now, where Goku can now just process. I mean, tap in the Super Saiyan God naturally. Yeah, yeah. Like without but having to go. Through. The problem with that is just how is it gonna be? Because he, they only he they he only has twenty minutes in their real time for them, pretty much. So it's like it's gonna it's gonna have to be some ass pull from just story wise purposes that just make sense. Which I don't want that to happen. That's why like that's why I rather prefer right now the whole Genki Dama. Uh, because I don't know, twenty minutes. I mean, sure, you can argue uh, with the fact that you know he was able to do it in the like how you're saying in the Battle of God's art. You know, he was able to do it. Um, but I don't know. I don't know yet. Well, I just I don't want to see two Trump the same Trump card be used multiple times in one one uh basically arc. Yeah. I, that's what I definitely don't want to see. Like if that, I wouldn't have wanted to see that against Frieza. Like when Frieza tanked it the first time, mm-hmm. I wouldn't have wanted to see him finish Frieza all using a super spirit bomb like he did against Kid Buu. Yeah. Like it made sense for him to use that against Kid Buu. Mm-hmm. Whereas he already tried it on Frieza, didn't work. Oh, okay. So now you got to beat him with the different means. <laughs> like if if they're gonna win, if 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 they're gonna fight and Goku is gonna win, it needs to be a hand to hand combat fight. Whew. My favorite. Because that's what that animation is calling. Yeah, my favorite. <laughs> hand to hand combat. Oh. Damn. That was crap. Alright. Well, I think that's it for us. Um, so thank you guys for being here. Uh, for this discussion. <laughs> this better be a good summon. <laughs> I mean, it's an SSR, so. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's a guaranteed oh, you SSR. Did it. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is delayed. I'm looking uh, at the TV. Yeah, it's, like, it's a guaranteed SSR. So. <laughs> oh, um, but it's it could have still been a better summon than that goat. Yeah, exactly. That's what I um. <laughs> uh, what's it called? Yeah, I think that's it for us. So, thank you guys for being here in this. I guess consider a live <laughs> discussion, really, <laughs> just with Devin Double O Devin here. Uh, if you guys want to check out his um, YouTube, feel free. I should probably put your, I'll probably put you. I'll put his, what was that? Was that you? Yep. <laughs> oh, I was like, what the hell was that? <laughs> Dude, that 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 was loud. Cause like I have headphones. I was like, oh damn, that's loud as hell for me. Oh uh, man, yeah. If if you don't, if you want to see anime stuff, I'll make a channel for that. Like anime stuff, Dokkan. I'm making another separate channel for that in the future. Oh, okay. Because right now, the channel, I actually use 007. It's straight from my Koyak. Okay. All right. Yeah, I don't want to touch nothing else, but all that's going to have to okay, do with Koyak. All right. Then I take that back, you guys. <laughs> uh, I'll let you guys know the moment he makes his new his new um, YouTube video with about animes and Dokkan and w- what else? 5,000 stones on Vegito Blue LR. <laughs> 5,000 stars on Vegito Blue LR right there with Devin. You that'll heard him be, right here right now. That first video. The, there you go, you guys. <laughs> no, was, no lie. No games played. I know he's, he's not, not playing. playing. I know he has those stones. He has more. Trust me, you guys. Trust me. <laughs> clickbait? <laughs> nah, that's not going to be clickbait with Devin. You know, Devin, he doesn't do clickbaits. If he's going to go ham, he's going to go ham. <laughs> 
anyways you guys that's gonna be it for <clears> this <throat> uh i guess sort of discussion not really review it's just discussing discussion of the last two episodes of dragon ball super 109 and 1010 Thank you guys for being here. Like always, I appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed the stream, make sure you hit the like button because that would be very much helpful. And I will appreciate it as well. If you guys are anyone want to consider to... What was that? Let us know if y'all like having these discussions about after anime, after episodes drop, so that we can discuss it together. Because what it really does is it opens up... Because everybody doesn't understand everything that happens in the episode. True. So when you have this discussion, you see people's different perspectives of what things have happened in the episode, and it broadens everything. Yeah. So yeah, let us know so we can have more discussions if that's what you guys want. Exactly. I'm also trying to tell Devin to watch this new show, Black Clover. Maybe we can do some discussions of that too. You know, one episode has been out so far. Maybe if he likes it, hopefully oh, that yeah. works out. I gotta watch that episode before I watch Super, because if I watch Super first, I'm just gonna watch Super yeah no yeah <laughs> uh anyways like i said um if you guys are new want to consider subscribing because i'm gonna try i try to maintain a daily live stream schedule so far my schedule is mondays blazing tuesdays is one piece treasure cruise uh wednesday is blazing again by helping out viewers only um thursday is dokkan if which sucks with dokkan is that i have nothing to do as much so if anything i might just do a video for dokkan at the moment oh, i question. don't know yet Yes. Are you going to have a day for Digimon? Yeah. Uh, and Friday, I was going to do Digimon. And then Saturday... Okay. Um, Another thing. Does Digimon have anything that's co-op? Yes, it has co-op. That's what I'm I making out. my Digimon right now. Do it. <laughs> and Saturday, it can be... I was going to be... It was going to be Saturday uh, FIFA, but I'm going to go back with FIFA Sunday. It's just this episode was just too good that I'm okay with postponing one, one FIFA away. But yeah, Saturday is pretty much up for the air, up in the air. It can be anything if you guys want. It can be I don't know a, a discussion of a different anime or or anything. Just let me know down some suggestions either in the comments or in the or in the stream or in Discord. But yeah, um, holy for didn't even think of Ultra Instinct, this guy. But yeah, uh, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. <laughs> so this is signing off of me and Double O. <laughs> um, even got, everybody knows it's Devin. Exactly. And <laughs> we'll catch you guys again in another maybe uh I don't know, maybe another Dragon Ball Super discussion or in a different I anime. Discussion so much talking. <laughs> oh <laughs> of course winner would. Uh, or or um uh another anime. But anyways, we'll catch you guys again the next time. Take care everyone. Bye. <laughs>